Wow, welcome everybody. Gaming Mike here, and we're going to play the free games of the month tonight, January 2018. Happy freaking New Year. We're also giving away, that's right, a three-month membership to PlayStation Plus. <clears throat> first things first, the giveaway is for subscribers only, so you got to be subscribed to win. Second thing, the hashtag tonight. Do you guys want to know what it is? Tell me you want to know what it is in the chat so I know you want to know what it is. Mike, 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 Oh, snap, we're already Mike. Mike, 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 Young, uh, Mike. Oh, welcome to it. Steel Dragon, Hilda, Wimberly, Complicated Much, Mike Young, Boondock Games, Richard Huntington, The 121. Who else is here? JP, uh, My Kitty Tasha, Scott Delaney. We got the full house. Colsey's here. <laughs> Wicked Thorn, Scott Delaney. I said Scott Delaney. Everybody's here. Richard Huntington, everybody. And, of course, thanks for the raid, Ivy Mike. Oh, those that were watching Ivy Mike play No Man's Sky just now. Uh... Thanks for coming over. Appreciate it. We've already been mic'd. We've already been full house, so it's safe to put your headphones back on. Those can't happen more than once an hour. All right, so we're doing a giveaway tonight. You can type uh, exclamation giveaway if, if nobody's done it recently. Nowhere Man will tell you about the giveaway. The giveaway is for a three-month membership to PlayStation Plus. So, number one, if, you're not a, uh, if you don't have a PlayStation... Um, it's easier if you don't enter. We'll figure something out if somebody that doesn't have a PlayStation account wins. But if you don't have a PlayStation membership, focus on. Uh, let's focus on the people that do have a PlayStation if we can. And I'm going to work on something to do uh, for other giveaways, like a Steam giveaway. I think I'll start doing Steam giveaways for to better to better accommodate those that don't play PlayStation that watch my channel because I want it to be all inclusive. This, these giveaways are bought to you by the uh, channel sponsors. So there you see them, Mike Young in the chat. Uh, with the warp cell next to his name. Anybody with the warp cell next to his name is a channel sponsor. So thank them for the giveaway. Because uh, their support brings these giveaways to you. <coughs> Colsey, if you've got a PS3, it'll work. You can get PlayStation Plus on the PS3 also. Stone, welcome to it. How can I give away Steam in a bell jar? Yes, complicated much. I will mail you a jar of Steam. This is not a true statement. Uh, but we're giving away that membership tonight. Uh... And it's going to be open to all subscribers. You have to be a subscriber to enter. Uh, that should be a given. And let's see. Just double checking something. Making sure everything's set. Uh, sponsors are also eligible. Sponsors, in fact, have increased odds of winning these giveaways. Since the sponsors bring them to you, they get the increased odds. And uh, sponsors, of course, also get the the sponsor emojis in the chat and that warp cell next to their name exactly exactly lazlo damas welcome to it over on twitch thanks for tuning in there and a reminder the giveaway you're only eligible to enter the giveaway if you're in the youtube chat tonight so you got to be in the youtube chat to be eligible for the giveaway uh that's how it's going to work but thanks for tuning in wherever you're watching gaming mike's channel so i asked it before and then i forgot to look for responses do you guys want to know what the hashtag is to enter there's a hashtag you have to type into the YouTube chat to enter tonight. Oh, and the other thing I need to specify is this is going to be for U.S. residents. Uh, the way it works, the way the code that I get is only eligible for U.S. residents. So you got to be U.S. resident uh, to be able to redeem the code. You can always re-gift the code. If the code doesn't get used, you can give it to anybody you want. But it is uh, only redeemable in the U.S. We found that out. Last month's giveaway winner was Nimrod. He's in Australia. He had a, a family member, I believe, that he gave his code to. So it was all good. <laughs> so here we go. Uh, I'm going to tell you the hashtag. The hashtag is winning. It's hashtag winning. W-I-N-N-I-N-G. Just like Charlie Sheen used to say. Hashtag winning to be entered in the chat tonight on YouTube. That's how it's going to work. I will give nothing. I will put the code in my soup. I believe you, Lazo. I believe you. Now, let's get to the gameplay. We've got a nice lineup this month. Nice lineup. As you can see on the screen, Deus Ex and Batman, the Telltale series. We're also going to be trying out Uncanny Valley, which is one of the PS Vita games that you can get on your PS4. But let's start it out with Deus Ex, Mankind Divided. Thanks for tuning in. Get your hashtags in. Hashtag winning to enter into the contest. We'll be drawing the winner tonight at the end of the stream. And that's how it's going to go. Here we go.
Oh, I'm so ready. Oh, wait. Sorry, y'all. I turned that off. <laughs> now I'm ready. Square Enix. They make good games. Complicated much, it's true. This game uses the autosave feature. This is vital information. Deus Ex, Mankind Divided. Alright. So I've not played any of the Deus Ex series. We're going to go into story mode. We're going to go new game. Uh, give me a story. Give me a challenge. Give me Deus Ex. Oh my god, look at his face change. He doesn't even have sunglasses. He doesn't even have sun... Oh, now he's got sunglasses. Give me a challenge. Give me Deus Ex. Oh, he's all beat up. Something's exploding in the background. Holy cow. You enjoy a good story and a good challenge. This is how the game is meant to be played. Uh, I'm figuring this is normal mode, right? Give me a challenge is normal mode. I intend to play for the story, but I want to play for a little bit of challenge. Let's go give me a challenge. You guys still have the blank screen. I'm sorry. Is it working now? What happened? <laughs> sorry about that. Thanks for the heads up in the chat. I see it. I see it. So anyway, here, can I back out? This is what I was looking at. No sunglasses. Sunglasses give me a challenge. Give me Deus Ex. He's all blowing up. Uh, I never asked for this. Is locked. I didn't even see that before. I never asked for this. He's I got blood on him. He's got blood on him. Okay, so we're going with give me a challenge. Uh, mankind divided. Human revolution standard or breach. You enjoy playing games as they were designed to be played. Even if there's a learning curve, you want to master the most fluid method of controlling Adam Jensen. The control uh, human revolution. The controls in Deus Ex Human Revolution were perfect. Why mess with a good thing? This is the closest possible recreation. Okay, so I don't care about that. Skills have been sharpened by years of playing various FPS games. No. Breach. Especially crafted for the ultimate Ripper experience. Speed runs. Oh, okay. So I'll just go ahead with Mankind Divided. X to jump. Square to reload. Circle for takedown. Uh, triangle for sprint. That's dumb. Triangles for sprint. L3 to enter cover, R3 to crouch, L1 augmentations, R2 throw secondary, L2 iron sight, R2 fire. That should be fine. Should be fine. You can enjoy Deus Ex Ma Mankind Divided as a standalone experience. Also relive the events of Deus Ex Human Revolution, which took place two years prior by watching a 12-minute recap video. Okay, so I've never played this series. Uh, I've never played this series. So let's go recap. The year was oh my god. Advances in biotechnology were helping people improve their physical and mental abilities to an amazing degree. Provided, of course, they had enough. Oh, money. you gotta have money. A new breed of people was emerging. Half human, half machine. And in Detroit, at least, not everyone was happy to see it. I just landed a job as head of Detroit security in Seraph Industries, a cutting edge biotech firm. David Seraph himself handpicked me for the job said he needed me to keep his people Whoa. safe. My ex, Megan Reed, was one of them. Brilliant neuroscientist, Megan had found a way to make augmentation safe and affordable for everyone. All she had to do was present her research to Congress. But the night before her big meeting, my security measures failed. A team of black op mercenaries failed. stormed into Sarah's headquarters, massacring everyone in sight. Three of the marks were heavily augmented walking tanks. Wow. Their mission? Take out Megan and her team. I tried to stop them. Their leader tossed me through a plate glass wall. Oh no, not a plate glass wall. The last thing I heard as his bullet slammed into my brain was Megan's dying scream. I should have died with her. Only I didn't. Should have, but did it. High-end military-grade enhancements saved my life. The best augmentation Sarah's money could wow. buy. It took me half a year to get a feel for her. Should have taken longer. But six months into my recovery, Sarah Industries was attacked Sunglasses. again. This time, by a radical group of pro-human purists. Violent, militant, and fanatically opposed to human augmentation. 
They claim to be members of Humanity Front, a non-profit organization that wanted the UN. This is intense. Technology research. The thugs broke into Seraph's factory and found machinists working overtime on a top secret military augment called the Typhoon. Not overtime. Seraph sent me to retrieve it. And when I did, I found one of the so-called purists next to it, wired with cerebral implants, no. trying to download its classified specs. Obviously, something more was going on. The Og killed himself before I could question him. No. Seraph ordered me to dig deeper. So with the help of Frank Pritchard, Seraph's head of cybersecurity, I did. Turns out a second hacker had been controlling the Og's actions from somewhere off-site. Pritchard and I tracked his signal to a secret FEMA internment camp in Detroit. The Black Op mercenaries were there. The same mercs. Oh my goodness. Left me for dead six months before. The I figured they'd try again mercs. when they saw me. It wasn't so easy for him this time. I took out the tank named Barrett. Even got him to give me a new lead. A penthouse apartment in China. Of course, we both knew it would be a trap in the end. Oh no. Hengsha Island, China. Home to a city so crowded, they had to build a second city. Oh my god. Trying to nice find clues in Hengsha wouldn't be easy. Lucky for me, I wasn't alone. Farida Malik, Seraph Industries' ace pilot, had lived in Hengsha before. A good person to have on your side. She knew enough about the place to get me around. Malik dropped me in the lower city, close to the penthouse Barrett had told me about. Bell Tower Associates, a private security firm under contract to the Chinese government, had agents tossing the suite when I arrived. Just tossing the suite? I didn't expect. Turns out the man who lived there was a criminal hacker named Van Bruggen. The same hacker who had been remotely controlling the AUG in Sarah's factory. Van Bruggen's panicked decision to force the man to commit suicide yeah. had been a mistake. Big one. Now his mercenary partners were gunning for him. And I needed to find him before oh, they Oh, great. Did. Locating Van Bruggen meant playing nice with the triads, anxious organized crime lords. They had the hacker holed up inside a low-rent capsule hotel. By the time I found him, Van Bruggen had no qualms giving up the woman. Literal capsules. Zhao Yunru, president of the Taiyang Medical Corporation. According to Van Bruggen, Zhao wanted to monopolize the augmentation industry and had hired black op mercenaries to destabilize her competition. Oh no. Seraph Industries was at the top of her list. To prove this, I needed to get inside TYM and grab a surveillance hologram off a server. I suspected Van Bruggen was hiding something when he told me this, but nothing could have prepared me for what I saw. Megan wasn't dead. Oh no, it's Megan, she's back. She and her four best researchers had been kidnapped. Spirited away somewhere while their kidnappers made it look like they were dead. Desperate to learn more, I confronted Zhao in her penthouse. She claimed to be a pawn in a bigger plan and hinted at a group so powerful it controlled global interests. At she a didn't whim. like my sunglasses. Then she slipped into a panic room and hit the alarm, forcing me to make a very quick exit. Bye. I figured Zhao was lying, but part of her confession made sense. Huh. David Seraph had been worried about his people. Whoa. So worried, he'd required all of them to have subdermal locator devices surgically implanted. Not subdermal. The GPOs would have been broadcasting the day of the attack. But Zhao sent a single call to Picus, the world's leader in global 24 hour satellite news, and turned those signals off. I needed to fly to Picus headquarters in Montreal if I wanted to learn. Wow. Eliza Kassan, Pikus Communications' first lady of news. Malik thought I was reaching when I told her Eliza was involved in this. The world's most famous news anchor, working with a mercenary <laughs> News anchors don't do that. But when I confronted Kassan in her office, she freely admitted to jamming Detroit satellites the night Megan's team had been taken. Said she's just been following her commands. I suspected she wanted to say more, but Black Op mercenaries showed up looking to shut us both down. And just like that, the Eliza I'd been talking to 
disappeared. A dang old hologram! The mercs were led by an augmented killer I crossed paths with twice before. Fedorova. A woman who'd made silence her best friend. She waited for me to track Eliza's transmission to a secret server room underneath the Pikus complex, then jumped me from behind. A deadly fight ensued. I made sure she never moved silently deadly. again. With she looks down, kind of like Rihanna, to keep Eliza but I don't hold that against her. She reappeared. Turns out Pikus's first lady of news wasn't a lady. What? She was a sophisticated AI program. Engineered to monitor data streams and control what people She's believe. a danged old robot. Eliza told me the Mercs had brought in a humanity front doctor named Isaiah Sandoval to remove the scientist's implanted tracking devices while Detroit's satellites were down. She yeah. also told me to speak to David Seraph if I wanted to learn more. By the time Malik and I got back to Detroit, tensions between normal and augmented citizens had reached a fire. It was point. way bad. Riots were breaking out in several cities. The UN was being urged to intervene. Seraph was trying hard to convince Hugh Darrow, the inventor turned philanthropist who'd once been a leading proponent of enhancement technologies, to help stop a possible regulatory vote. Seraph had a lot riding on Darrow. Megan's discovery would have given millions of people the chance to evolve beyond their normal human abilities, and at the same time, catapulted Seraph Industries to the top of the Fortune 500. Huh. According to Seraph, no. Megan's kidnappers knew this, and didn't want people evolving unless they controlled how it was done. You can't control evolution. Illuminati, and urged me to keep searching. I had a drink about it. Determined to do so, I tracked down Sandoval via America's most outspoken augmentation opponent, Bill Taggart. Sandoval's boss and founder of Humanity. Bill Front. Taggart. Sandoval admitted to operating on Megan's team when I confronted him, but said he hadn't removed their GPLs. He'd merely switched them to a different frequency. Oh. Pritchard was able to trace one of the signals to China. Malik and I immediately took off in pursuit. Unfortunately, the Illuminati were one step ahead. The Illuminati. Ambushed. Shot out of the sky by Bell Tower Associates, seconds after entering anxious airspace. Malik's piloting skills saved me. After a tense and bitter struggle, I escaped into the lower <laughs> The tracking signal I was following led straight to the triads. Or more specifically, to the augmented arm of Tong Xiao, uh -oh. leader of a gang of augmentation harvesters. Tong said they'd taken the arm off a corpse, which Bell Tower had left at their door. Meaning, at least one of Seraph scientists was dead. Maybe not the rest of them, though. Tong pointed me to a port used for human trafficking and helped me slip aboard a Bell Tower huh. ship. We were sailing to rifle the bank the station, for a, while. a military base in the South China Sea. Bell Tower was holding kidnapped civilians as prisoners there and using them to perfect the Hyron project, a human computer interface that left most of its test subjects dead. Whoops. Not for a mysterious ally named Quinn. In exchange for my help exposing Bell Tower, he slipped me aboard a second ship headed to Singapore and an Illuminati run biotech facility called Omega Ranch. Three of Seraph scientists were there, <laughs> forced by their captors to create a technology capable of remotely shutting down augmented abilities. Thanks to an emergency recall notice issued by the World Health Organization, millions of people all over the world already had the biochip installed. With the help of the scientists, I tracked Megan to a private section of the ranch. They had naked people all over there, the place. I ran into Yaron Namir, the walking tank who put a bullet in my brain first. Not that night. guy. He teamed up with Zhao and was hoping to catch me off guard. But her little ambush didn't work. I found Megan in a suite belonging to Hugh Darrow, the billionaire philanthropist who Seraph had called on for help. Dara had convinced her to go along with the biochip plan by promising to sabotage the tech. As she was explaining this, Dara appeared in a global broadcast, oh no. telling the world that augmentations Michael Douglas. were the death of mankind. Then he activated the biochips to prove his point. 
All over the world, augmented people flew into a killing. Oh my god. Darrow had betrayed everyone, and it was up to me to set things right. To do it, I had to reach Panchea, a massive installation in the Arctic Ocean. Wow. As I raced through corridors built by an all augmented workforce, I saw death and destruction firsthand. By the time I shut down Darrow's broadcast, I knew the damage he'd done. Still, the future remained unclear. How would the world react to this sabotage? Would people ever regain their faith in augmentations again? What would be the Illuminati's next move? Only time to give us the answers. Wow. When your dad explains his life story. Holy cow, that's quite a recap. Pretty intense stuff. I've heard a lot of good things about this game. I'm excited to try it. It's Deus Ex. I once thought I could save the world. But like I totally could. Now look at it. In yet another augmented terror attack, 251 passengers aboard Sista Airlines Flight 451 were killed. When an augmented passenger broke into the plane's cockpit uh -oh. and ruthlessly butchered its flight crew. Uh oh. Details recovered from the black box recorder suggest that the man may have been suffering flashbacks to the AUG incident. That horrible day two years ago when augmented people all over the world flew into a psychotic killing spree causing the greatest loss of life in recent history. Wow. That's pretty brutal. Sometimes, you just have to let go. And embrace what you've become. Not gonna go all wonky on us now, Hansa. Are ya? Well, if I do, McCready... Oh! I guarantee you'll never Look see out. Agent Jensen, Jesus! Am I gonna have a problem with you? No, sir. No reason to assume you would. Good. Because you are the only augmented operative on oh, this really? team. Oh, really? And I intend to make good You're use of you. You're a bunch of normies? Listen up, all of you. We've got a sandstorm barreling down our ass, and we can't afford to make mistakes. We're going after this man, an arms dealer named Shepard. He's ex Bell Shepherd. Tower, one of the special forces commanders who disappeared during the incident. And he's come out of hiding. That cannot be good. It's not. He's selling weapons and military-grade augments to terrorists. Terrorists. This That's is bad. Aran Singh, the undercover agent who lured Shepard out of his hole. Best you see Interpol's got. For three years, he's worked hard to get in tight with the Jin, an Iraqi smuggling cartel that's uh -huh. infected the Eastern Hemisphere like uh -huh. a plague. Last week, I'm memorizing our all of this. sent a message to the Jin, offering to sell them a shitload of black market merchandise dirt right. cheap. They told Singh to handle a buy. They're not gonna like it when Interpol disrupts their party. Is things cover really that good? It is right now. We need to keep it that way. This is where the deal's going down. A half-finished high-rise hotel that's been abandoned ever since the incident. It's not a pretty picture inside. Let me guess. Most of the laborers were augmented with heavy-duty industrial nice guess. So when the incident hit and they all went schizo, Things got gruesome real fast. And no one, except for some homeless junkies, have been inside the place ever since. So what's the plan, Director? Yeah, get to the point, Seems Director. Seems meeting Shepard on the ground floor, inside the hotel's main atrium. He sent the bulk of his gin crew to the penthouse levels to secure a vantage point. I want McCready's team to take up positions overlooking the okay. atrium and make the arrest. Jensen, you're going in solo from the Roger roof. that. My objectives? Keep the gin from joining the party. As far as we can tell, only one route connects the atrium to the penthouse uh -huh. level, a halfway decent elevator shaft. Halfway Here, decent? I want you to block access to it. Fine. Just cut me loose. Cut me loose, Captain Do you plan on Colonel. relying solely on your augments for this yeah. one? Yeah. I'd recommend taking a little hardware, just to be sure. Okay. Uh... Lethal or non-lethal, we've got a UC here. Might be easier to maintain his cover. He's not the only one still breathing when this is done. 
I'm not leaving my six exposed. Give me that. Le give me something lethal. What happened? Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? <laughs> what a time to do that. What a time to do that. I hope we can jump right back in there. It was so lethal it crashed the game, y'all. Did you see that? Did you see that? Let's get back into Deus Ex Mankind Divided. We saw the recap. If you're just joining us, welcome to Gaming Mike's channel. Thanks for coming along. Hit that like button if you're digging it. We're doing a giveaway tonight for a three-month PlayStation Plus membership. Type hashtag winning in the chat if you haven't already. And you'll be entered to win. We're drawing a winner at the end of the night. Hashtag winning. Just like Charlie Sheen used to say. Suggest non-crash. Yeah, I should have picked the non-crash option. <laughs> oh, lethal or not lethal? Crash. Oh, what? Uh, yeah, the volume's up. I was just checking something. Just checking. Nope, new game. Okay, give me a challenge. Mankind divided. No, no recap. I'll watch it later. Okay, so we start right here. We start right here. Sorry about that. I'll see if I can skip over this guy yakking. Thought I could save the world. Skip. Uh, lethal, non lethal. Lethal, non lethal. Lethal, non lethal. Is it going to crash again? Did that crash the game? What do you guys want to do in the chat? Wait, 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 wait. Let's let the robot handle this. Uh, lethal, non lethal. We're going to do a poll. Vote in the chat. I should have done this while I was reloading the game. For one minute. Start the poll. You do exclamation vote and the option. And that's it. Exclamation vote one or two. Lethal or non-lethal. What should we do? Lethal is one. Non-lethal is two. Exclamation vote. Lethal or non-lethal. One or two. You got one minute. You've got one minute, everybody. Thanks for coming along. Sorry about the crash. Twitch doesn't let it. No, nope. no votes on Twitch, Laszlo. No votes on Twitch. But thanks for holding it down over on Twitch, Laszlo. I am streaming to Twitch, Mixer, Smashcast, Periscope. Periscope goes out to the Twitter. So wherever you're watching Gaming Mike's channel, thanks for tuning in. Hit like if you're on YouTube. Feel free to follow on any of those, those other channels. And over on YouTube, we're doing a giveaway tonight for a three-month PlayStation Plus membership. We're playing the free PlayStation Plus games of the month. Laszlo, I've got nothing but respect for that. I understand your decision and it's fine. Almost time's up. Most votes for lethal. We're going lethal. There it is. I'm not leaving my six Hell exposed. No. Give me something lethal. Your call. But Singh's undercover in all this. So watch your fucking sights. What yeah. about range? There's lots of white spaces and high ceilings yeah. in there. But a number of tight and constrained rooms too. So it's a crapshoot, really. <laughs> oh my god. How many of these choices are there gonna be? Is it worth it to vote on every one? Combat rifle, revolver. I'm going revolver. I'm gonna choose the rest. Never I'll just choose the rest. The odds. Give me something I can use up close. You got it. One last thing, Jensen. What is it? Singh said that Jin are using some sort of portable Wi-Fi device to boost communications. He's got a better chance of maintaining cover if you disable it. Oh, really? It. We'll keep an eye out for it. But aren't we on the clock here? You said there's a sandstorm Yeah, tick tock. There is. And we got the intel on this mission at the very last minute. So we're scrambling a little. If it comes to it, your number one priority is keeping the Jin out of that okay. atrium. Copy that. Copy that. <laughs> Time to put away your heavy thoughts, gentlemen. We're approaching the target building. You're up first, Jensen. Let's do this. Oh, here we are in Dubai. Task Force All right. This is Knife Leader. Engage us drive. The B2.
Uh oh, here we go. I'm so ready. Oh, no, I wasn't. Ah -hoo. Nice. I like it. What is that? Are you kidding me? That works? Never works when I try it. <laughs> you know it, Laszlo. Okay, here we go. Team leader, this is Jensen. Team leader. On the roof. Solid copy. Move into the building. The access route you need to block is at the far end of the okay. penthouses. And keep in mind, the direct route might not be the easiest one. Roger that. McCready will advise once his team is on the ground. Miller out. What do you mean it's throwable? Oh, R2 to throw. Yeah. Take that. It's my traffic cone. Oh, ouch. Okay. So maybe you don't want to do that all the time. What's this? What is this? R3 to crouch. What is this? Treasure. I got a triangle code. Nope. I didn't want to do that. I want to... There we go. Give me that credit chip. That's my credit chip now. Any other treasure? I didn't expect to be looking for some treasure so soon in a first person shooter. Yeah, I get hurt from jumping down a ledge. <laughs> get out of here, birds. I had to try it. <laughs> oh, what's this? What's this? What's this? Oh. Punch it. Oh, hell yeah. I don't need to open that one. Screw that noise. I'm going to punch right through it. Uh-oh. Hey, mister. Are you okay? <laughs> yeah. Ladder climb. Oh, switch to third person view for ladder climbing. What was that? Who was that? Jensen, we're moving through. Oh, what? Fuck. What's wrong? The gin have got a few jennies up and running. We're gonna have to hack keybacks. Oh, bags. great. You should enjoy it, McCready. They have colors and shapes. Just remember, red means bad. Fuck you. Right, get these boxes out of my way, would ya? I hate them. Give me that. Give me, give me this. Oh, excuse me. Yeah, get in there then. No, give me that. Oh, I can rotate it with L2. Oh, here we go. Yes. Give me that. Kia. Into the ocean. <laughs> I don't care. <laughs> I'm the worst hero in the world. Take all. Give me that. What was it? Some kind of health thing? X to jump? Yeah, okay. I can jump. Oh, grab a ledge. Oh, great. I don't know. I expect guys to jump out and start shooting me like any second now. I don't know what type of game this is. Hold L3 to open the inventory slash augmentation wheel. To equip smart vision, select it with L. Press L1 to assign. And circle to exit. Smart vision. Circle. Oh, smart vision. Look at me. I'm so smart. Kia! Aw. Oh. Hold on. Let me just, let me just, uh, that didn't do anything. Weakness, use the weakness. Oh, nice. I used the weakness. I got to stop shooting everything. Okay. Give me that. Uh, hey -ah. <laughs> Oh, jumped right through there. Yep. Oh, toolbox, huh? Where's a wise guy? I got some tools for you do some work what's up here what's this huh oh where's the where's the secret item what's this nothing smart vision what is it disabled what is it connected to 
Hell with that. Oh, look over here. Oh, look. Oh, uh, I just had to reset the breaker. Oh my god! Look out for that! Oh, great. Oh, great. Well, what am I going to do about that? Warning, electric hazard. What else is around here? Oh, shoot. I better climb up this thingy. Up, oh, up. Oh. oh, here I am. Oh, there's a hole in the wall. Oh, wait. Oh, we're good. It's all good. I'll just leave that electrical hazard for the next port, Sap. Huh? Use it. Uh, hack it. Uh, L to move the node ahead. IO port. X to capture nodes. What? Diagnostic. Security rating. Capture detection. Registry. I can fortify this. Oh, I can capture this. I want to capture a node. Anomaly oh shit! Detected. Trace program. Move initiated. the registry with L and capture it before time. Capture what now? Capture what now? What am I trying to capture? What am I trying to capture? Oh, I gotta stay focused on what I was doing? Is that it? Oh no! He's gonna get me! Denied. denied! Oh, that this, it scared me. It scared me. Okay, now what? A bunch of guys gonna pop out and shoot me? Where are they? What? Only one chance? Only one chance to do that? Start from the blue I.O. port and capture all the green registries. Oh, now I get a help screen. Navigate the system by capturing nodes using the X button. High rated nodes take longer to capture and have a higher de direct detection percentages. If detected, you will have limited time to complete your hack before being locked out. Okay. Now I get it. I gotta restore power to the keypad. Are you joking me? It's already... Get me up there. Uh, use it again. Okay, let's do this. Okay. Uh oh. Trace program uh oh. Capturing. Capture it. Capture it. Go do it. Access Hooray! Granted. Hooray! I did everything right. Can I open it? Oh, where's the guys? Where's the guys? There's two guys over there. Uh oh. Tutorial mode. Follow the green holograms to receive tutorial instructions about various game mechanics. Experiment without any consequences. You can reset or exit at any time. Learn about moving to cover, cover swapping, rounding corners, vaulting over cover, and transitioning from cover to first person view. Let's try tutorial mode. Press L3 to take cover. Okay. Aim and cover. Press X. Oh. 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 Oh, okay. Cool. Go around corners. Great. Should I sneak up on that guy? Where's my smart vision? Wasn't there two guys in here? Did I miss something here? Oh. Aim at the next cover. 
Da -da 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 -da. It's R to aim at the next green hologram. Where's the next green hologram? Oh. Do you want to exit and reset or retry the tutorials? No. Exit. Oh, okay. Now I gotta do it for real. Dan, 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 bam, dan, 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 dan. Hello. 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 Dan, 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 dan. Surprise! Hello! You're my new friend. How long do they stay knocked out for? I don't even know. Smart vision. I see you. I'll be smarter than that and look around. Oh. There's a dead body here. Dun, 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 what? You heard nothing, you saw nothing. You heard nothing, you saw nothing. Go to sleep. Surprise! Oh, what happened? Did he see me? He sees me. He knows I'm here? You don't see me. Yeah, he does. I got him. Uh, pick up. Oh, wait. What can I do to him? Oh, I'll take those. I should have disarmed these guys I knocked out, too, huh? I probably don't have time for this. Whoa. Whoa. Uh, rooftops? Penthouses. Uh current floor rooftops. Oh, go to penthouses then. Don't forget to loot the bodies, Jackson, yeah. Mac, listen up. Doppler shows that sandstorm's moving in You don't fast. say. It's big, and it's gonna hit us okay. hard. God, I hate the fucking desert. I hate the desert. Confirm visual. I'm saying I can. It's everywhere. Time is not on our side. Copy that. Solid copy. Solid copy. That's a big solid copy, 10-4. What are we doing? Oh. All the green holograms. Uh... Yeah, let's try the tutorial again. I like that. Activate the glass shield cloaking augmentation. What? I got a glass shield on. That makes me invisible. Oh, I'm all sparkly. Reach the holograms. Oh, I'm supposed to just be, like, sneaking around. Tutorial completed. Exit. It's one of those surprise sandstorms. I don't have my glass shield on anymore. Oh, oh, hey, buddy. Shoot me all you want. I'm the hero. It takes like a million bullets to get me. How do I switch weapons? What the hell? That was bad. They installed the signal booster already? Oh, I see. Oh, hey, guys. Good. There is too much writing on this thing. Last thing we need is the drone breaking down. What's up, this sandy duct? Sav Jazz, welcome to it. Nice to see ya. McCready, how you making out? Slower than expected. It's like someone's tilled a fucking cemetery down here. Say again? 
When the shit hit the fan in 27, the rush must have been for the stairs. There's corpses everywhere. A lot of your cousins are here too, oh, Jensen. No. You want me to grab you any sp- Uh-oh. Grab me any what? Smoke me a kipper. Let's do the tutorial. That was fast. I installed the signal booster already. R1 to hold or throw grenades. Good. There is too much riding. What does it want me to do? Oh, I can jump down. What? Uh, I don't know what it was trying to teach me there. Just throw grenades at people sometimes? McCready, how you making out? Slower than expected. It's like someone stole the fucking cemetery down here. Say again? When the shit hit the fan in 27, the rush must have been for <laughs> the stairs. There's corpses everywhere. A lot of your cousins are here too, Jensen. You want me to grab you any spare parts? No parts. But I take mine with cream and two sugars while you're asking. Good night. Oh. Nice one. Wow, brutal. I'll take that. Were you armed? I'll just take all the guns. Where's the other guys? I guess I just head over this way. Oh, not enough energy. Jensen, watch your 20. Working my way through the penthouses. Remember to keep an eye out for the Jin's communications booster. If you can, oh disable my God. it. Roger that. Buddy, pick a direction. Uh-oh. Did he see me? Come over here. Get you off. Never ending invisible backpack. You know it, Mikey. We love it. It holds all the treasure. There's one. Oh, there's two. Uh oh. He's coming right for us. <coughs> Nothing. I was going to shoot that canister, but there was like some auto aim action going on. Where's this guy? Oh, no. Oh, don't do that. Hold R3 to open the quick inventory to regain health. Oh, that's how I switch weapons. Uh, L2 to use a bio cell. Is that my health? Oh, R2 to use a hypo stim injector. Where are they? Oh, come on, explode. How are you not going to explode? Where'd he go? Where'd he go? There's a guy. Got him. How do I get out there? Oh, there's a ladder. That's convenient. Yeah, first person shooters. Not usually my thing. Listen up, everyone. Chang's hacked into the Jin's radio signal. Checking the patch now. 
We should be hearing sing any second. خليل الراجل اللي هيبقى علينا الحاجات جاي كمان شوية روح قول لبقية الناس ان انا هعصلكم وخليكم يعني منتظرين باتشز كلين سوليد كوبي جود I'll repatch us once the deal kicks off Okay, repatch us then King's Quest was a great one These games are better in third person on your opinion, Savjaz Does this one let you switch? I haven't really seen an option to switch Where'd that other guy go? Oh, he's out there? How'd he get out there? What about this? Dun, 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 dun. Jensen, we're inside the atrium, taking up positions on the terraces. What's your 20? Still moving. Well, hurry the fuck hey. up. Enemy helos inbound, and this sandstorm's getting close. You get that comms booster disabled? Negative. Didn't find it. Well, you better hope Singh's cover stays intact. Otherwise, you'll be answering to oh, me. Oh, okay. It is just situational. It's only first person sometimes, third person sometimes. Am I gonna have to hack it? Yeah, let's hack it. Okay. Which way is the green one? Oh, snap. I see. Oh, I got right in there. Access Hooray. granted. Hacked it. Uh oh. Sunglasses? Yeah, oh, I still got them on my face. I hate this door. This is Jensen. Penthouse access route secure. Jin shouldn't be a problem. Okay. Copy that. About fucking time. Enemy helo sighted. Enemy helo? Not that. Strike force, position and hold. Strike one, in position. Strike two, boss. Strike three, you're right. Strike three, yeah. Strike four, in position and holding, boss. Eyes up, safety's off, guys. Yeah, no shit, brown nose. Watch your fucking oh, mouth, hey. holiday. Both of you shut up. Everybody watch Five your language. Position. Everybody stay sharp. Singh's got eyes on Shepard. Patching you in now. Wow. Targets in the AO. Remember, Singh's down there, so watch your fire. You got ball, Singh. Executing a buy with a sandstorm on our ass. I cannot take credit for Mother Nature, mister. You can call me Shepard. Shepard. How biblical. Are these the weapons? The they, know, they look like the weapons. They're getting harder to come by. Guns are still on the chopper. Show me the cash quick and we'll... Oh, what the? Oh, snap. The party's been crashed. By who? What's going on down there? Miller, this isn't the gin. Repeat, it's not the gin. Who is it? They're after the weapons. Open fire, open fire! Weapons free! Open up on Agreed. Let me get a grab for the chopper. You got a shot? Negative. Negative. We're under heavy fire Whoa. down here. We can't let that chopper take off, Jensen. I got it. Oh, okay. I got this. Seal off access to the this atrium. This is bad. They're closing in. We're going to lose Singh. Jensen, I can't reach him. Oh, I was supposed to find a signal booster. Can I jump off this thing? Oh, oh, yeah. Sweet. Is this Jensen, a bad guy? This sandstorm might have just bought us some time, but you need to disable that chopper. I oh, killed man. him. Oh, great. Good time to reload.
Why am I... Oh, I'm out of ammo for that? Oh, I'm running low on ammo for everything. Uh, okay. Take that, mister. I can't see. I can't see. Oh, God. Somebody saw me. I can't tell where I'm getting shot from. Oh. Hey, y'all. Oh, give me that. Battle pistol. Oh, I've got smart vision. I've got smart vision. Oh, look at battle rifle. It's a battle rifle. Man down. Man down. Where? Who's hit? Jensen. Strike team. Sound off. It's Sing. Repeat. Sing is dead. Oh, good fucking job, Jensen. Who's that? You fucking bell end. <laughs> you bell end. I can't see. I need more energy. Oh no. Oh no. Jensen, step it up. That chopper's about to take I'm off. trying, boss. I'm trying. Did this guy just come back to life or what? What else can I do? This thing? Oh yeah, I can do this thing. Oh, 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 I don't have any ammo. I don't have any ammo. No takedowns. Jensen, we're out of time here. It's down. Now I never what? Oh no. What happened? I died. Rip. Crazy Og, y'all. Crazy Og. Crazy Og. Load latest save. I wasn't sure what I was supposed to be doing there. Do you just have to fight them all out of the sand? That was a pain in the ass. Yeah, the bad guys are in red. I got that. I got that. Get to the chopper. Game over. Oh, continue. All right, let's try this again. This is bad. They're closing in. We're going to lose Sing. <laughs> no. Jensen, I can't reach him. Oh, see? Oh, he's empty. Oh, I can get one of these right off the bat, but it's only got one shot. Oh, oh, excuse me. What's happening? I got a switch. This sandstorm may have bought us some time, but I need to do what now? I didn't hear him. <laughs> okay, charging in there does not work. Charging in there does not work. I was trying it. I just wanted to try it. I just wanted to try it. That's not the way to do it. Arnie would know what to do. Arnie would know what to do. Praise Yawk. Charging in there is not the way to go. This is bad! They're closing in! We're gonna lose Sing! Jensen, I can't reach Boom. him! Alright. He's still empty. Oh, that guy died. Jensen, this sandstorm might have just bought us some time. But you need to disable that chopper. Come shooting at me. Oh, this guy. Uh, uh. Where'd you go? Oh! Why is your mask off? Oh, who's shooting me? Who's shooting me? Oh yeah. It was this guy. Oh no!
no ammo in that either. Are you kidding me? What do I have ammo for? Nothing? Oh my goodness. Run right then invis to helicopter. Alright, I'll try it. I forgot I keep forgetting I can turn invisible too. Sandstorm is disorienting. Get to the chapel. <laughs> This is how this is how good I am at FPS games, you guys. This is bad. They're closing in. We're gonna lose I like that, though. Jensen, I can't reach him. What did that grenade not hurt those guys or what? Oh yeah. Jensen, this sandstorm might have just bought us some time, but you need to disable that. Chopper. Not enough energy. Not enough energy. Look, jump, run, jump, into the helicopter blades. How do I get into it? How do I get into it? I got to the helicopter. I got to the helicopter. I got all the way to the helicopter. So, that's Deus Ex Mankind Divided. <laughs> that's one of the PlayStation Plus free games this month, in case you didn't know. Welcome to the new viewers tuning in to Gaming Mike's channel. Thanks for joining me for that first play of this game. It's available if you're a PlayStation Plus member. And uh, that's going to do it for that one. We're going to jump into Batman next, but just in case you're uh, new to the stream but weren't here at the beginning, we're doing the, the giveaway for the three-month PlayStation Plus membership at the end of the stream today. You have to type hashtag winning into the chat on YouTube. If you're watching on one of the other channels, you'll have to tune over to youtube.com slash gaming mics channel. Uh, to enter by typing hashtag winning in the chat and then at the end of the stream we're going to draw a winner. This is for U.S. residents. Uh, you, have to be, you have to be able to access the U.S. PlayStation Store in order to redeem the code for the membership. And uh, if you don't have a PlayStation, you might as well not enter because you wouldn't be able to redeem it. Uh, it'll be easier if we save this. I'll do other giveaways at some other points on my channel for uh you know pc players i'm gonna start doing some steam giveaways too i'm thinking of stuff to do with that but i've been playing these these uh free games of the month on my channel pretty regularly so this has been a good one to start doing the giveaways and these giveaways of course brought to you by the sponsors of the channel that you see there in the youtube chat with the warp cells next to their names uh these guys have been supporting the channel big time for a long time and so this is, uh, these giveaways are so that we can, I don't know, share some of that love. Get some PlayStation Plus memberships into people's hands. Things of that nature. Can you tell I'm in the middle of doing something else? I'm almost done, though. Deus Ex. Mankind Divided. That was what we just played. We're going to play Batman the Telltale series next. Are you guys excited for that? Has everybody, has everybody typed in their hashtag? to win seems like it you're taking off JP alright we'll see you later thanks for coming by pee break no I don't need a pee break do you need a pee break Mikey are you guys ready for some Batman y'all ready for some Batman let me change the titles of the games uh, the Telltale series let me change the titles of some games really fast also before we get it kicked off because I know people don't like to come into a stream that's not what the stream says the stream is. There's Batman the Telltale series. And... They're updated. They're updated. Said I was doing something. Oh, I did it. Oh, is pimping plays here? Pimping effect. Oh, you're just saying pimping effect. <laughs> Alrighty. Yeah, let's do it. Yep, close that. So, welcome everybody to Gaming Mike's channel where we're going to play for the first time Batman the Telltale series. Telltale series has done a few in the past. We did the uh, Game of Thrones Telltale series for one of the PlayStation Plus first plays a few months back. These are uh, more pick and choose, like make your choice and see the story play out.
type of games, which is really fun a lot of the time. This one's supposed to be really good, too. This one's supposed to be just great. Batman, the Telltale series. Checking for DLC. Don't worry about it. Let's just play episode one. This has got five or six episodes, I think. We'll check. But for the PlayStation Plus, it's free this month, and it's got all the episodes. It's the complete package. They released these episodes uh, over time, originally. Batman. There we go. Episodes. Episode. Okay, see, look. Well, two, three, four. There's five episodes. Oh, don't tell me I have to download it. Okay. Start episode one. Select a bat tech color. Where's green? Where's green? We're going yellow. Yeah, I held the Justice League was good. I liked it. Loading. Genghis Ron, welcome to it. Hey, Busath, welcome. Adapts to the choices you make. The story is tailored to how you play. By how you play. Oh, here we go. Batman. City Hall, 8.32 p.m. Founded 1820, City of Gotham. <laughs> Scary guys, bad guys. Watch out for the laser guys. Nope. Get it open. On it. You better hurry. Hey, you think he's gonna show? He'll bring the whole goddamn place down. Stay focused. We'll be out of here before anyone can stop us. Okay. <laughs> Move in. Hey, Commissioner. Bad wait! Man. Wait for backup! Don't need it. Take the stairs. I heard stories, you know. Sent three home in an ambulance. The rest in body bags. No wonder the cops want him dead. Hey, you ever seen him? Yeah, Gotham Zoo. With all the other flying animals. Oh my goodness. Oh, push X. Hey, yo! Push circle. Oh, interactive. <laughs> Glorious. Glorious. As you may have guessed, I'm Batman. Oh, I'm Bruce Wayne, psych. I'm Bruce Wayne. I'm all. I'm at home. You can't keep doing Why this. Why not? I have to. <laughs> no one else will. Every drop of blood, everything you've sacrificed, the city is safer now. But it's made you a target. 
and people will keep you in the crosshairs uh, until you're shut out of the they sky. They need something to fear. Criminals in this city. <laughs> they need something to fear. Yeah. Shit! The hell did he go? Whatever got in, don't let it get out. Oh my god. What's gonna happen? I'm watching for button presses. I know I missed a couple back there. Oh, swipe left. I mean right. What was that? I'm Batman. Iceman, welcome to it. Huh? 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 Oh, nice. <laughs> it's like the horror movies. Zoop. Back to back, circle up. You're not gonna circle up on me. I got a smoke grenade. Bitches. <coughs> the hell is this? Psych. Psych. Whoop. Nice. Did I get both? I bet, man. Oh. I know you're trying to create a myth, but be careful you <laughs> don't turn into a monster. Sometimes you need a monster. Roar, Alfred. Come on! Come on! Come on! <laughs> Oh, X. I almost didn't see that. Oh, swipe. Not fast enough on that one. Oh, my goodness. This is a lot faster pace than I'm used to from Telltale Games. Oh, up. Oh, no. Look out now. Oh my gosh. Oh, wrong button. Oh, Batman. Oh, X and R2. Y'all. I just captured Phasma in his face. Oh no. Oh. Oh. Howdy boy. Up, up, up. I did it. I did it. I pushed it three times. Three times I swiped off. Catwoman! Didn't your mother teach you no. to knock? My mom died when I was young. Behind yeah, you, big yo. boy. The guy with the saw! Heyday. Not for you, Catwoman. Oh, down. X. Oh, that's scary. This is like a non-stop boss fight in most games. A lot of boss fights are like this these days. No, Catwoman! Oh, your gadgets have gadgeted me! Damn your gadgets. I've got gadgets. I don't think I don't. Uh-oh, the cops. You're under arrest! I'm never under arrest, stupid. Bye. Well, if you want to be intimidating, you're succeeding. Criminals are becoming afraid of you, so are the Good. police. It's a scare tactic, Al. Just a performance. Uh huh. Sure. We all believe that, Bruce. You're totally stable. Without a scratch. So far. Oh snap! I'm gonna scratch you up, kitty cat. 
That doesn't belong to you. Oh. I was wondering if we'd cross paths. You? you broke the law. Here I am. <laughs> Cut the shit. <laughs> the Thank law. You. Don't tell me that's why you do all this. Ah. Uh. Squeeze into a suit, tie on a cape. Most people dress I do it for the thrill. I do this for the thrill of it. I'll Still show remember you a thrill. that. Gotta admit it though. You give a good uh -huh. chase. One day you might actually catch me. Tonight. Don't you know not to corner a wild no. animal? It's dangerous. Oh, I'm dangerous. Then let's put you in a cage. Whoa. Bring it, Bat. Yeah. Oh, down. Up. Oh my god. Circle, I missed it. Huh. You missed. Oh, down. Oh my goodness. Look out, Batman. Oh, up and square. Up and square. Did I do it? I think I did it. I can't really tell if I made the right choice or not sometimes. Punch. Oh, I've Captain Phasma you. Out. Did I miss something there? I feel like I missed the button. It's Catwoman. Oh, did I? So reactionary. <laughs> Cost ya. Oh, take that, Catwoman. It's over. overtime. I wouldn't be so sure. Uh oh. Uh oh. No. Oh, look out. I don't think so, Catsy. Oh, did I get it or not? I got it. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Brian G, welcome to it. Look out. Who are now? Jesus. I got him. Wait, wait, wait. Do not He's a friend shoot. of mine. Look out, Catwoman. Triangle. Oh. Oh, look out. Oh, face plant. Does that hurt? Oh, time for the bats. Circle X. I'll take that. Bye bye. Oh. Nice moves, Batsy. Why go to all that trouble for this? Yeah. Shit. Can't even play snake on it. A myth can't be killed. You, however, are flesh you and think blood. think so? Oh, buddy. God damn it. You stupid cop. Great. No, wait. Way to go, cop. Oh, oh, I, how come I can't? Oh, what happened? It was the other stick. It switched to right stick and didn't tell me. And it was a lot more sensitive. Batman! I'll take that. Oh! All of your arm strength, ouch! Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh my goodness gracious. Catwoman. Holy cow. Yeah, she got wrecked. One arm dangle, there we have it. <laughs> Guess I was wrong about you catching yeah, me. Yeah, a little bit. Not sure if it was for my sake. Talker, I drop yours. you. Who put you up to this? Answer me or I let go. But you won't. You're not that kind oh, of yeah? guy. Oh, yeah? Bye, Bat. 
Oh, hey. <laughs> oh, okay. So you can just do that, huh? She took my grappling hook. Hey, that lady stole my grappling hook. Was his blood just smoking? Are you a demon? Step out of the shadows and be Bruce Wayne oh. tonight. Oh, that's a much harder fight. Yeah, it's tough being a billionaire. Don't let tombstones be your family legacy. Well then. Yeah? Time to save the city. Oh, time to save the city, y'all. <laughs> I'm going to go drink champagne and eat caviar till this city is fine and dandy. I'm Batman. I'm Batman. I'm Batman. Oh, hell of an in intro. You like that one, Mikey? Thank you. <laughs> Thank you, everyone. A humble district attorney like myself is not used to such a ringing endorsement. And even one who cut Gotham's crime rate You're in not half. Tommy Lee Jones. Now, for too long, this city has burned with corruption and greed under Mayor Hill's authority. No. But I promise you, a vote for Harvey Dent is a vote to finally put your foot down. And together, we can stamp out the fire and save our I great city. Fires. If only Mr. Wayne, my campaign's largest backer, could have heard that applause, he would sh Well, there he Psych. is. Fashionable and fashionably late, as always. Say hi, Bruce. Hi, Bruce. Oh, it's an option. Hi, Bruce. <laughs> well, I tee him up and he knocks him down. That's how Mr. Wayne and I do business. Thank you. Thank you again, everyone, for your unwavering Our support. Our business is lining things up and knocking stuff down. What? Together, we will change Gotham. For the better or the worse? Mr. Wayne, thank you for opening your no house problem, to us. Bobo. Now, I know this is the biggest mansion in Gotham, but I don't think you got lost on your way here. <laughs> Where were you? Settle down. I know you prefer the brooding billionaire angle. So the sooner we make nice with the donors, the sooner everyone will leave Working you alone. Working the night shift, baby. Just work in the night shift. Yeah, well then you're pulling a double. Uh -huh. Double no life. Here tonight Never to heard see of it. Me. Some they want to see the Bruce Wayne. Am I right? <laughs> and I can see him just fine from here. It shouldn't be uh -huh. painful. It's not a kidney stone. It's only a little FaceTime with potential derpa, donors. Derpa. Your face, specifically, with a mouth that's saying, Support Harvey uh -huh. Dent. We're the grease, they're the wheels. Doing this for Gotham. They're rolling in enough cash and votes to help make Gotham a place for families again. I'm gonna finish my drink. Ah, a little liquid courage before facing your adoring uh -huh. public. This will help you too, Bruce. Once I've turned this city around as mayor, you'll be a hero for funding my campaign. Now all I need is a decent slogan. I'm terrible at those. It always makes me sound like a used car A new salesman. face for Gotham. All right, all right, all right. How about <laughs> uh, a new face <laughs> for Gotham? Ah, <laughs> you. It's not half new bad. New face. I'm gonna use Sounds that. like something else, Bruce, maybe. I meant what I said. Together, you and me, we change Gotham. A city free from crime, where children can play in the streets again. That's what I want too, Harvey, but you know how rough it is out there. We have to shake things up to make shake that happen. Shake it up. Well, we can start with a few hands. Oh, hmm. shake the hands up, Bruce. Come on. Shake them right up. Shake it up. Fancy party. That's a fancy party, Bruce. Mr. Wayne, I'd like to introduce you to Bob and Regina Zellerbach. Of course I know it's these It's pronounced two. Regina. Hello, Bruce. Regina here is the chairwoman of Wayne Enterprises, and her husband voted for Mayor Hill last Oh, time. really? I'll admit it, Mr. Wayne. I don't know Mr. Dent from a pothole on Main Street. Oh, snap. But I trust your family. If you believe in Dent, we believe in you. After all, whoever you support is a reflection on you. And we trust someone like you to lead this city to greatness. <laughs> well, I'm flattered, truly, but this night is about getting Harvey Dent elected so he can fix those totally. problems. Huh. I think I speak for half the room when I say politicians are puppets. Oh, oh come on now, Bob. Wise old man, huh? I'm not a politician. I'm a crusader. Hmm? No strings attached. Old families like ours should flock together, you know. 
like birds. You don't say. You're preaching, dear. No, it's true. The Wains and Zellerbox are reminders of the golden age of Gotham. Zellerbox. This city's luster faded years ago, Mr. Dent. Look at Gotham now. Murder in the streets, corruption in City Hall, that Cape Bat freak dealing out vigilante Who are you justice calling a freak, like old the man? wild goddamn West. Oh, Bobby, regarding golden age, seems you're getting cranky in yours. There's always hope. Forgive me for being blunt, but one man can't save this city. And it's oh. a dangerous mentality to think so. That's how you get creeps like this Batman. Harvey Dent is our best shot. <laughs> Put him in a room with anyone for 15 minutes and that grin will win him. Totally. Over. He's going to need more than that, son. Oh, they will remember that. 15 minutes yet, Bob. We've still got time. Hey. Uh, don't worry, though. I am not doing this alone. And with Bruce's help, we're replacing the dangerously unsecure Arkham Look at that look he's given him. With a state-of-the-art mental health facility to help Gotham's most at-risk Oh, individuals. Arkham Asylum? It will be dedicated to Thomas and Is Martha Is it Arkham Lake Asylum? In the hopes that their fate will never be repeated. After all your parents did for this city. Oh, to be killed in a botched robbery in some alley. For real, bring it up. It Let's talk terrible. about it in detail. Truly Let's terrible. talk about it right now. Yeah, and tragedy like that at such a young age it must have been crippling. If only that uh, deranged man had gotten the right treatment, maybe... I'm going to say uh, nothing. Well, I don't like to think about maybe's. You're breaking my heart, lady. And I'm sure you don't Look at either. my heart breaking. It was a tragedy, truly. And I will fight from City Hall to make sure nothing like that ever happens again. Enjoy the rest of your evening. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Not saying I doubted you, but that went better yeah, than expected. Well, it is a night of ringing endorsements. They're all deeply scarred, Richard Huntington. Deeply, deeply scarred. No, he's not hiding his dislike at all. Oh, well, what hello. the hell is this? Harvey Dent, Gotham's next mayor, and eager to know you. Vicki Vale, not oh, interested, hey. and reporter for the Gotham Gazette. This is a private fundraiser, Miss Vale. No reporters That's allowed. That's not Kim well, Basinger you don't mind at all. Stay and ask a few questions, do you, Mr. Wayne? Well, you can ask me whatever you want at the press conference tomorrow. Actually, I'm here for Mr. I Wayne. I do mind. Actually, I... Get out of here. If you're not on the list, you're not here. So. <laughs> oh, you do not exist, ma'am. <sighs> we'll talk tomorrow, then. Mr. Wayne, you've... You've got something on your collar. Um, <laughs> is that blood? Perhaps? Yeah. It looks like... Uh, actually, it's, uh, it's uh -ho. Well, no wonder you were late. You Say get no it now, Harvey? Do excuse me, Master Bruce, but uh, another guest has arrived. I'm sure they'll find the bar. You may want to greet this one personally, sir. Carmine Falcone. Oh, Falcone. Is the Dent campaign soliciting votes from Gotham's biggest crime family? Falcone's never been convicted of anything except being a businessman who loves this city. Excuse us, Miss Vale. You guys think Vicky Vale is Catwoman in this? That would be quite a break from traditional Batman. <laughs> and what kind of business do you think? Kind of looks in? like her. The one that controls enough votes to get me into City Hall. This is the necessary evil of politics. Bruce. You're the necessary. It's in the service of a better Gotham for all of us. Look, at least hear him out before you kick him out. Falcone requested to speak with you directly. I don't want him in here, Harvey. I don't want him in my home. You stupid ass. Actually, you don't want him angry. Oh. Trust me. A word of warning, Bruce. Yeah. Gulp. Play nice. Um, how about I kick him out? You know, I've been in the market for a new house. Decent walk up, sky high ceilings, plenty of room for my cars. I think I'll take it. Stop it. Though the decor <laughs> offends my You can't eyes. afford it, bitch. <laughs> Man, all flash, no class. Well, you couldn't afford oh, it. Oh, burn. Yeah, right. Yeah, nobody else noticed he was bleeding. Come on, Falcone. Thank you for welcoming me into your home. Get out of here, famous actor voice guy whose name I can't think of. Oh, everybody's watching. You're a respectable man. Hell no. Snubbed.
snubbed. You better remember that, Falcone. Gentlemen, perhaps we'll all be more comfortable in the parlor. Follow me, if you will. Yeah, Dent is totally... Yeah, I agree, Danny. I don't like it. It's fishy. Get out of here, Falcone. Uh, you should know, Mr. Falcone. My analysts say we're raising triple with Mayor Hill. Hey, Get out of here. Private audience. <sighs> Billiards Come players on, only. Guys. Bruce. Go find a blackjack table. You'll be fine table. out there, Harvey. I saw plenty of skirts to keep you busy for a well, few minutes. I'll talk to this guy alone. We talk alone. <laughs> Just you and me. Sorry. Get out of here, Harvey. Yeah, I'll, uh, I'll get a drink or yeah. something. Christ. Go find out if Vicky Vale is Catwoman. Bye. Yeah, well, that's just like Harvey, huh? Wants to make sure the rules are followed. Uh-huh. That's his good side. But in my experience, there's the law... And there's doing what's right. You understand? No. And I'd rather see Harvey actually help this city instead of just say any will. Unlike most people, I believe I've in met, Harvey. Harvey actually has integrity. He's trying to make Gotham a better place. So am I. So I are you. you. Hey, we all carry this city on our broken backs. Might lighten the load if we do so together. Oh, really? Slurp. I ain't here to chinwag about politics, Mr. Wayne. Gives me indigestion. I got enough of that as is. You should eat better. So, let's talk Chew relationship. Chew your food more, baby. Chalk this for me. Excuse me? Be a pal. Excuse me? I can get Harvey the mayor's seat. Or I can pull it out from under him. Get the hell out of here, bud. Chalk your stick. Whatever happened to being a gracious host. Shut up. Okay, imagine. This is me. And these are all my friends in uh -huh. Gotham. The businesses, restaurants, clubs, I get docks, the metaphor. unions, politicians. Yeah, then you're gonna break it? You're gonna break the table. Okay. I make them all move. Right. And I want to keep everything moving if Harvey gets elected. You just have to hit the ball all the That's time. That's why I came here tonight to your lovely home. Hoping to make a new friend. One who can help Mr. Dent see the light. If need be. You and I are not friends, yeah, bud. That's not happening. Hey, this isn't a deal with the devil. You wish. You listen to me. Oh, kid. he doesn't like it. I know. Somewhere inside that tuxedo, you understand this situation. Money gets money. The risks, the alliances, the hidden costs. Your father knew which hands oh, to Oh, really? And which to break. Don't you dare talk about oh. my father. You're getting worked up over nothing. <laughs> Hell, I knew him longer than oh you Oh my did. god. People don't say no to me. Not for long. Get out of here. Master Bruce, your guests are leaving. Oh. I recommend seeing them out. You wouldn't want to be rude. <laughs> yeah, you wouldn't want to be rude. Heed your butler's advice, kid. Oh, and I'm no longer interested in buying the house. Good. The owner's a prick. Oh, hey. And he's going to get what's coming to him. Wow. <laughs> okay. Okay. Was that the whole first episode? Was that all of episode one? A Telltale Story by Zach Keller. Oh, episode directed by Kent Moodle. That was just the opening. It's me. Who's me? <laughs> Episode one. That was just the intro. Wow. Realm of Shadow.
Another brutal week in Gotham, folks. A string of home invasions rippled through the city's already crime-infested East oh, End. Oh no. Apparently, the bandits are using storm Not the crime-infested East End. He still has the tickets. What? Remember to keep those front doors locked tonight. And we have breaking news tonight. Five criminals are in custody this evening after a break-in at City Hall. But thanks to the efforts of the Batman, the stolen items were Thank returned. Thank God. Not all of them. Let's see what she was really after. Allegations that Dent may have actually been involved in the break-in. Talk about dirty politics. Oh. Hills Access the codex. Whoa. Okay. Boop, boop, boop. And we get we get info and data. And in other news, cool. You're now on day three of the factory fire that will not end. Crews have given up trying to combat the blaze at the Otisburg Processing Center. Arkham Asylum, Wayne Enterprises. Still no word on what started the fire, <laughs> but whatever's burning there has resisted everything the fire department has thrown at it. They're recommending people avoid the area and seek immediate treatment if you happen to breathe in any of that tar black smoke. And okay, some news stories. A headache for commuters this morning. The body of Falcone family capo Louis Pistachio Garbo. Louis Pistachio was found hanging off the side of the 4th Street Bridge. Sometimes nearly fell off a building for this. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Analyze it at the bat computer. Latest headache for the riders of Gotham's overcrowded sky rail cars to contend with. Where is the Which one is the bat computer? Of riders receiving abdominal wounds from an ice pick or other pointed weapon while gadgets table orders with fellow passengers. A few have died. Wow. While most have been in your eyeballs are looking differently. Spare grapple. Can't believe I let Seriously, her dude. Smoke pellets. Well, the test run at the mayor's office was a success. Uh -huh. Only three have been caught to date, but all these okay. escapees highlight the rough. That's the gadgets table. Oh no. Well, there's the Batmobile. Wait, I need to analyze this thing at the Bat computer. Oh, there's a data port. Hooray. Oh, there's my chair. Oh, I wonder where I put that. Let's find out what was so important. Bleep, bloop, bleep. Damn, encrypted. Gah. Wayne Manor has seven bedrooms, two kitchens, a library, a gymnasium, a basketball court, and a movie what? theater. And yet I always find you here. Yeah. In a dark, damp cave. Well. In front of a computer. Yeah. I'm more at home here than the rest of the house, you know that. Then we should build an eighth bedroom down here. <laughs> sure, I can see the headlines now. Bruce Wayne, billionaire, entrepreneur, cave dweller. Why would they write headlines about where your bedroom is? Resume. Did you find out what that um, cat woman tried to steal? Well, in the process. Well, what are we looking at? Let me try a tour. different angle. Oh, to rotate the hologram, use left stick. Okay. I have rotated the hologram. What am I looking for? This is a map of the east side oh. shoreline. But it could mean any number of things. Money, weapons, drugs, everything flows through that port. Maybe it's where Mayor Hill picks up his dry uh -huh. Thanks, Alfred, you're helping. Hmm. Can't make sense of it yet. There's still plenty of files to decrypt. Plenty of files. And in the meantime, I saved you what I could. Thanks, Thanks. Al. Yeah, the same couldn't be said for the bar. 
I had to literally pry Mrs. Zeller back away. But you'll be pleased to hear everyone has left, including Mr. Falcon. Oh, good. Before the game switched from billiards to cutthroat. I'd recommend leaving the fist fights to your alter ego. Bloodstains are much harder to remove from a tuxedo. <laughs> I bet. I don't want anything to do with Falcone. Well, he certainly showed interest in you. Uh -huh. That's what worries me. For the record, your father despised men like Falcone, thought they ruined Gotham's stellar reputation. Back when it still had yeah. one. It can again, Bruce. Oh, it's got a reputation Though now. people like this cat woman aren't helping. Is she new to town? I've never seen her before. She knows the rooftop. Hopefully, she's just a tourist. Oh, no, I already checked the codex. Not much to find, apparently. Right. A few burglaries, break-ins. Seems to lay pretty low. You could learn a thing or two from her. You can't step outside without it ending up in the news lately. <laughs> As Bruce or Batman. Right. I don't like being compared to a comic. Yeah. No, I think you're missing the point. You have to admit you've been drawing a lot of attention to yourself. And not the playboy billionaire buys new yacht kind of attention. Right. Yeah, I don't mean to beat a dead argument, but... No one's gonna figure it out now. Trust me. You sure? Miss Vale noticed your injuries. So did Mr. Dent. If they put it together with the incident at the mayor's office, it would undo all the long nights and close calls we've endured to get here. You're in the spotlight more than ever. You have to be careful. You're right. You're right. You're right. I should have canceled the event. But I know how much pressure you're under. <laughs> I don't mean to add to well, it. Well, it's okay. I, I know you're only... You're my father it. figure, Alfred. If we make a suit that fits me, we can trade places somehow. Uh -huh. Though I'm not partial to That's heights. That's funny. Uh, old men worry, that's all. It's our gift and our curse. One more worry for the list. Your friend's running for mayor. Park 6 a.m. Oz. I thought I saw Oz. It's been, what, 20 years? Last time I saw him, we were in grade school. Wow. Indeed. You two were thick as thieves. Oswald, however, took that role more literally than you. Oswald. Dishonorable discharge, illegal boxing matches, arms dealing, prison what? stints? That's a criminal grand slam, if I'm using the expression I correctly. I think that's right. Unfortunately, you are. Oswald claimed he only wanted to catch up, but his behavior following his family's collapse is troubling. Why he's returning now, I... I haven't the faintest idea. Uh... Do you think he might know something about the break? Not a coincidence. This Catwoman shows up around the same time Oswald comes back to town. Might not be a coincidence. Oswald's crimes, numerous they may be, are on a much smaller scale than robbing City Hall. Well, he was always trouble growing up, but... <laughs> it's the fun kind of trouble. <laughs> you both were. Even though you and young Master Cobblepot used to be close, Cobblepot, I'd advise oh. you to be cautious. Oh, but I know you can't abandon a good mystery until it's Oswald solved. Cobblepot. I'll be careful, Alfred. When you see what's become of his park, I think you will. We all know who Oswald Cobblepot is, right? Right? Cobblepot Park. Meanwhile. Hey, buddy. Uh, where are you, Oz? You at your park, your family's park? Are you? Is that where you are? Oh, walk around. Hey, Mister. Nope. What if I wasn't done looking at that graffiti game? It's real touchy. Look at. Oh, the penguin. Yes, the penguin. Palette PC, welcome to it. <laughs> well, I looked at it. Balcony at Dent Fundraiser. Oh, no, they reported on my social event. 
Are you okay? Are you okay, mister? A homeless person? Here, have some change. You are a homeless person. Uh, thank you, this sir. This is my money. Uh, I'm going to examine you now. You are a homeless person. <coughs> okay. Consider yourself examined, citizen. Goodbye. I will look at this burning barrel. <laughs> This is the part of the, these games that kind of loses me sometimes, is when it gets to this uh, wandering about. <laughs> Running late, meet you by the statue. Oh my god. Great. Oswald, I'm already by the statue. There's the statue, but no Oz. Da 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 da. Oh, hello. Oh, I'm going to look at this shopping cart for a minute. Yep. Turned over right on its side. That one's on its wheels, though. Fair enough. Hello, smoking man. Nice mohawk you have this evening. Hey. Beat it. Oh. Like the Michael Jackson song? Oh, oh nobody likes a rich guy. Here's some more graffiti. Yep. I see it. Look at the plaque. Oh, that statue. Well, that isn't what it used to be. Gotta love that mohawk, hell yeah. The plaque used to be something different, apparently. Uh, hello? Is that is that Oswald behind me? Watch wallet cash. With this goes through. I I was talking to you earlier. I thought we were friends. Uh oh. Hey, you heard him, man. The hell are you waiting for? <sighs> Sorry, fellas. I've got nothing. Got nothing. Uh oh. And him. Gentlemen. Uh oh. Oz. Keep walking, all right? This don't concern you, twerp! You see, that's where you're mistaken. My old mate and I have some catching up to do. Oh. And you're uh. in the moment! Come here! You think that'll do? Whoops. Oh, I missed. I pushed it too late. Stay Playing. down! Uh-oh. Yeah. This used to be a nice place. No lives like you don't belong. <laughs> oh, watch your head, bud. Oh, he'll watch it for you. This is my park. Mine. You hear that? Now get out of here. <laughs> oh, hey, Bruce. You've got a little, uh. You got red on you? Yeah, good as new. Woo, that was the right <laughs> little scrap, eh? Nothing kickstarts the system like a dash of adrenaline, eh? Besides, someone needed to deal with the rubber situation oh, here. Yeah. Hey, I could have handled that myself. You mean a knife handle in the back? Because that's what would have happened, mate. Uh, no offense. Yeah, all right. Yeah, it's been what? Two decades. Yeah, pretty much. And you know what? I haven't been mugged once that entire time. <laughs> Interesting. <laughs> uh, yeah, that wasn't why I brought you here, mate. Right now, I am trying to recognize the little Bruce I used to run around this place with. Back when it wasn't, you know, like this. Yeah. This park used to mean something. A place that was safe for kids, for families. People came from all over to visit. Oh, Mom and Dad, they put so much work in here. Glad they never saw it like this. Well, those were better days. <laughs> that they were. Yeah. Thought we'd grow up to be kings, I did. I kind of did. 
This city chews right through people. Ah, uh, you're just getting drunk right now? Mum committed to Arkham. Dad. Ended it yourself, he did. My family's fortune. There's nothing left, Bruce. I know. Alfred told me. Okay. It's funny, huh? Same place that ground my family to dust. Gave you the good life. Used to run in the same circles we did. Hobnobbing parties, round the world vacations, unlimited potential. My parents are gone too. <laughs> yeah, Oz. I know, Bruce. I know. I'm sorry for it. But I had my own funerals to attend. Oh. Good to know you haven't changed, Bruce. You still care about something more than just yourself. Although, I was surprised to see Carmine Falcone at your party last night. Oh, really? Made himself right at home. That oily. <sighs> Falcone was an uninvited yeah. guest. That's it. I don't like him. I never want to see his face again. On that, we can agree in earnest. Oh, good. Falcone made a stack of cash and corpses a mile high, ruining families like mine. All he needs is a little push. And... Uh-oh. It'd be a treat to watch him at pavement. You have bad intentions. Sorry, mate. This reunion got a lot more grim than I planned. Things are gonna be on the upswing soon, no? Okay. A revolution is knocking on Gotham. You sound so sane right and now, I'm here Oswald. To let it in. So sane. Which brings me to you, Bruce. You see, you throw a rock in any direction, you break a window that Wayne Enterprises owns. As the rich and powerful go, uh -huh. oh, you top Gotham's list. Uh -huh. But when my revolution starts, we're gonna smash windows and cross off names all the way down. Whoa. Like I said. It's not gonna be pretty. It's gonna be beautiful. That's a battle you won't win. Yes. Oz. No. Oh, I've learned a thing or three since we were kids. I've got great affection for you, Bruce. I really do. Which is why I'm warning you. When this whole thing starts, make sure you're on the right uh -oh. side. Uh-oh. That's definitely a threat, I'm pretty sure. Good seeing you, Bruce. Nice to see you too, I guess. I got some rocks to collect. Cheers. Okay. Bye. Press conference for new hospital starts soon. Car waiting on south side of park. Thanks, Alfred. I was done here anyway. How'd that can get up there? Dun, 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 dun. Meanwhile, back at Wayne Manor. Oh, that's where they're going to build the hospital. Light of sky falling. Welcome. Yes, that's about it. Mr. Wayne, over here. Right here. Mr. Wayne. Mr. Wayne. Mr. Wayne. Mr. Wayne. Mr. Wayne. Bruce, Bruce! Bruce! Good morning, Hello. Everybody. I'm a friendly, normal person. Morning, Mr. Dent. Hey, Bruce, you mind if we swap cars? I mean, mine isn't fast and the paint's <laughs> rusting off, but boy, does she have no. charm. No, you can't have my car, Harvey. <laughs> we didn't bring you all out here to discuss cars, honestly. <sighs> now, we're here about Arkham Asylum. Ever since it opened its doors, Arkham has been a breeding ground for the criminally insane. Alfred, you never text me. Its methods for rehabilitation, crude. Its security, lacking. And worse still, those who do get out, or God forbid escape, are even more <laughs> dangerous than before they went in. Arkham Asylum is a cancer on Gotham. Oh, is it? But today, with a sizable contribution from this man here, we break ground on a state-of-the-art mental health care facility. One that will improve the well-being of Gotham and its citizens for years to come. Now, Mr. Wayne has a few words he'd like okay. to say. Bruce? Allow me to freestyle. 
My parents. My parents loved Gotham. They invested their blood, sweat, and tears in the It was the really gross. <sighs> you know, when I was uh, nine years old, my parents took me to see a movie about a hero. And mask. then? It was a hero who stood up to oppression and defended the people from injustice. Well, then what happened? No matter the what, cost. What happened then? That night... Yeah? My parents paid the ultimate cost defending me from a man. The ultimate. <clears throat> who needed the kind of help this new facility will right. provide. Nice save. Uh... Let us honor their memory with this new facility in the hope that a night like that never happens yeah. again. You feel bad about that, old people? I hope so. Today, on the anniversary of that fateful night, we dedicate this facility to Thomas and Martha Wayne and usher in a new era of healing for Gotham. Yay! New healing, yay! All ten of these people are happy about that. I'm, uh... Sure, you all have plenty of questions about the new hospital, so let's open it up. You first, Vicky Vale. Thank you. Right. With the opening of this new hospital, what does this mean for Arkham Asylum? And are you Batman? What happens to the old building? Uh, leave it standing. I say we leave the asylum standing as a reminder that we can do yeah. better. This time, we won't fail those who need us. Crumbling most. old buildings are awesome, too. All right, who's up totally next? Totally great. Uh, you there. Mr. Wayne, Julia Remark of the Tribune. Hi. My sources say you welcomed alleged mob boss Carmine Falcone. I didn't even his shake home. his hand. You even spoke with him behind closed doors. Harvey. Uh. I don't make friends with gangsters. <laughs> he was an unwelcome oh. guest. That's all. Next question, yeah, please. Yeah, screw that guy. Please keep your questions on topic, people. Thanks, Harvey. We're here about the hospital, remember? Read it. Harvey, read it. Urgent. Uh, but Mr. Wayne, this morning the Globe received evidence of an offshore bank account managed by Carmine Falcone and your no father, way. Thomas Wayne. What exactly are you implying? Transactions connected to organized crime going back years and continuing to this no day. Way. The paper trail ties your family directly to the mob. Care to comment? Where's your paper? Show me the paper. I doubt your evidence, And did sir. anyone else receive this evidence? The Globe, the Gazette, we all did. Mr. Wayne, oh, Mr. Mr. Wayne, is all your money Mr. dirty? Wayne. Is the Wayne family legacy built on lies? Did you know uh -oh. about this, Bruce? How long has your family been dealing with Falcone? Could the allegations be true? What are you telling us? Does the mob sign Wayne Enterprises' paychecks? <laughs> I think you should check your source. Sounds to me like an intern is finally putting their creative writing minor to good oh, use. Oh, burn. Mr. Wayne! Mr. Wayne! How long has your family been dealing with Falcone? Uh-oh. Could the allegations be true? Uh-oh. Did you know about this, Swipe right to run what away. Are you telling us? I'm sorry about this, Bruce. I don't know where the hell it's coming from. Damage controls my territory. We'll talk later. Everyone, everyone, please settle down. I'll be fielding your questions from here on out. Please, let's try to keep this okay. civilized. Bruce, I've been trying to reach you. The police are inside the manor. Yeah, we were texting. Oh, no, the police. <laughs> oh, light of sky falling. Welcome to it, by the way, if I didn't say it. Hey, hey, careful. Put it back. I'm afraid Get out of here, hand. Mr. Wayne. Says who? This warrant. No. It's not personal. I had the boys turn the lights off, keep a low profile. There's got to be a mistake. That's what we're here to find okay. out. Maybe we made a mistake. Maybe you uh -oh. did. Uh-oh. Alfred, keep an eye on them. Make sure they only take what they have to. <laughs> of course, sir. Yeah, keep an eye on all the cops throughout the entire house. I meant what I said about not personal. We only want files related to Wayne Enterprises. The warrant covers your place, pardon me, places of residence, and any companies you own. Your holdings are extensive. Oh, yeah. And what do you totally. expect to find? It's for our analysts back at the precinct to figure out. 
I can't comment. It's a valid warrant. I gotta serve it. Mayor oh. Hill signed off on this himself. As long as he's mayor, he calls the shots. Well, Hill has a history of making his opposition disappear. Yeah. Rumors and allegations, Mr. Wayne, that's all. But if they become fact, I'll handcuff him myself, same as any other. Okay. I don't know how your neck ended up on Mayor Hill's shopping block, but here we are. <laughs> Hill knows if I go down, Harvey's campaign goes down too. That'd be a real shame. Mr. Dent's the only DA I ever trusted to make a conviction stick. As mayor, I think he can finally turn things around for wow. us. For all our sakes, I pray you've got nothing to hide. Yeah, me too, I guess. See ya. Bye. Hey! Clumsy ass, regular uniform cop so and so gathering evidence, breaking pictures. Wada yada. Oto. Oh my god. No, we don't need to see it. Bruce, stay back! We don't need to see it. Take whatever you want. You, yep. You don't have to do yep. this. And there it is again. The death of Batman's parents for the one billionth time ever. That was kind of cool with the picture and the light. I'll, I'll give it that. Bruce? I, I didn't mean to interrupt, but... Uh -huh. Do you have a light show going on in here? This is the second time you've shown up uninvited. We'll see you later, Wicked Thorn. Well, it's difficult to book a meeting with you. Well, I enjoy my privacy. Yeah, reporter. Enjoyed. Past tense. Because you have violated it. Sorry, but if the press has their way, you're not going to have any for a while. Uh-huh. Okay. Listen, Bruce. A scandal surrounding a beloved family like yours captures the public's attention. Uh -huh. I can help you get the right kind of attention. Through my connections at the Gazette, I have all kinds of access. I can dig up whatever you need to fight this. What's your yeah. angle? Not all reporters just want a headline. Some of us are old-fashioned. I still want the You're truth. You're not old-fashioned. The Gazette received this supposed evidence like every other media outlet. And it's all hearsay. Flimsy sources. There isn't a shred of hard Flimsy. proof. Flimsy. Still, allegations like this, they, they, they don't magically appear. Someone is going after my family. Yeah. After me. That's rude. Obviously, the sender didn't identify themselves. We have no idea who it could be. I mean, no one's even done their due diligence on this yet. Carmine Falcone wants me to be in Totally his Falcone. He crashed Harvey's fundraiser and pretty much said, hop in. Yep. Well, maybe he thinks putting a little fear in you will make you jump. It won't. <laughs> By oh. tonight, <laughs> this scandal will be broadcast to every screen in Gotham. Everyone will be talking about it. This isn't my first pass through the rumor mill. I know the damage it can Yeah, girl. Then go on the record. Right here, right now, and stop it. You need to get out ahead of this. Uh, Your side is what matters, not wild speculation. Give a quote. On the record, then. Whenever you're ready. I Batman. The Wayne family has always been a cornerstone of Gotham. We have never had and never will have connections to organized crime. That's exactly what the people of Gotham need to hear. Oh. Okay then. You're gonna beat this, Bruce. The Waynes always come out on top. Uh -huh. Goodbye, Miss Rail. Are you flirting with me? She was flirting with me. I hate to admit it, but everyone smells smoke. A fire is heading this way. Batman has made plenty of enemies. Batman? My family. We've done nothing but support Gotham, even in its darkest days. All this on the anniversary of your parents? It's not a coincidence. It's not. Harvey's the district attorney. He should have told me this was coming. Then find out why he didn't. Uh-huh. 
Everyone flirts with Bruce, even Alfred? Yes. Hey! <laughs> Cafe Triste! Okay, wait. That's gonna be a good place to break. We're gonna take a break there from Batman, okay? So that's our first play of Batman, the Telltale series. We saw a little bit of the gameplay where it's uh, some button selecting to dodge and fight and stuff. And uh, we saw some of the decision making. So there it is. Batman the Telltale series. One of the free games on PlayStation Plus this month, January 2018. Let's do that. Menus. Okay, so... That's the second of two games we played tonight. A Deus Ex Mankind Divided and now Batman the Telltale series we've played. But let's close that. Let's close that. And we're also giving away that PlayStation Plus three-month membership tonight. We've got one more game to play. We'll give the game away after we play Uncanny Valley. But first, to anybody that's new in the chat, be sure to type hashtag winning into the YouTube chat. If you want to be entered to win that three-month membership, you've got to be a U.S. resident and you need a PlayStation because uh, it only works if you got a PlayStation. But it would work with a PlayStation 3 or 4, so you're good either way. So make sure you've typed hashtag winning in the chat. You only have to type it once to make yourself eligible, uh, but be sure to get that in there. And that's that. Uh, that's what we're doing tonight here on Gaming Mike's channel. So thanks for being along, and don't forget to hit that like button. What'd you guys think of Batman? You like it? Hilda wants me to play it all the way through. I can tell. That's a fun one. I don't know. The Telltale... I'm kind of like half and half with any Telltale game I play. Like, some of it's good, some of it's not. But if you guys want to see more of that, I'm sure I could accommodate. I'm sure. I'm sure I could. <laughs> it's pretty good, though. It's pretty decent. Um, let me see here. I gotta also clip that out. What else did you guys think about that? What did you... Is that one that you guys would like to play yourselves? Is that something you would play? And of course, if you're watching from the future, feel free to leave comments uh, as you watch along. That's also fine. Totally, totally fine. There we go. Please, pretty cool game. <laughs> you guys liked it. All right, well. No, that's why I like to get the feedback on this, too. I want to know what you guys want to see me play on the channel. So if you guys would be interested, if you guys and gals would be interested in something like that. I'm, I'm more than happy to uh, keep playing through a game. A Batman movie with gaming mic commentary. <laughs> Otherwise, you're going to have to find a Let's Play. Well, we don't want you to find a Let's Play somewhere else, Hilda. That's for sure. That's for, sh that's for shizzle sure. All right, should we play some Uncanny Valley? You guys think we should play some Uncanny Valley now? Let's do it. The guys and we gals are for it. Tower the Creations. This is Uncanny Valley, everybody. One of the PlayStation Plus free games of the month for January 2018. We're going to do a first play of it right here on Gaming Mike's channel right now. Disclaimer, every action you take with in the game will lead you to different outcomes. To fully experience Uncanny Valley, multiple playthroughs are recommended. Oh! So this is one of the PS Vita offerings. You can get it on uh, PlayStation Network. It's uh, made for mobile, so expect that from it. What are the controls? Movement. Inventory cursor, inventory, time, flashlight, ready gun, interaction fire, reload, pickup items, advanced dialogue, sprint. Okay, sounds good. Let's play. Uncanny Valley. Oh, it just showed me that again. Click the touchpad to open inventory. Press on item to select it. Drag and drop the item to the uh, onto the interacted object. Okay. Click the touchpad to open inventory. Go to health tab. Drag and drop bandage. So you can bandage yourself. Circle the ready weapon. Triangle to reload. Press X to fire. X to continue. Okay, here we go. Oh, it's one of these. Hello, I'm a bum. I just woke up in the garbage. Hello. Yeah. How did I get here? The font on this. I could push that dumpster to... Climb over the fence. Fence cutters, that is. Convenient. Click the touchpad to open. Okay. Oh, wow. 
What? What what does it want me to do? <laughs> no? I didn't quite see what he said. I missed something already. The joy of these games, sarcasm and play. Yeah, it's uh we'll see how long this lasts. Can you climb up there? Oh, can I use the fence cutters here? No? Okay. Nope. Can't climb up. Nope. Nope. Can't climb up there. <laughs> Just cut your arm off. Oh, I kind of want to right now. What does it want me to do? Can I keep walking? Nope. You gotta be joking me. Fence cutter. Um. <laughs> Push box to where you were and use the fence cutters. Which which box? Oh, oh. Where, on this window? No. Oh, there's a fence right there. Hold on. There's a fence here. <laughs> there's a fence here, you guys. There's a fence here. Go on. There was a fence there. You guys, you use the fence cutter on the fence. You get it? Ah! Oh! Oh my God! What? 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 <laughs> what? Oh, I'm waking up again. Oh, hello. What was it? A dream? Yeah, I don't know, dude. I, at least he didn't wake up in the trash this time. No! Oh my god, they're at the window. Oh my god. Ah! Ah! <laughs> what is going on? <laughs> Uncanny Valley. <laughs> oh, there's your intro. I, I having night terrors again and apparently I'm talking to myself great wow <laughs> that was uncanny oh hoy but just joining us again right on yeah this is uncanny valley it's uh awkward I just I don't know when those things are gonna come back anarchy man anarchy man hello you can tell I'm anarchy man because of my scarf what's that what's this what's this that homeless guy This is not Batman. You're correct. Uh, nut foot. Nut foot. I guess I'll walk towards this officer. You must be the new guy. Tom, right? Nice to meet you. I guess let's go to the car. It's fucking freezing. Oh, that was fast. Nice to meet you too. Here we are in the car. So, how's work? Oh, great. I can sit on my ass all day without anyone monitoring me. So, you didn't run into any trouble so far? 
Look around you, man. We're completely isolated. There's nobody here. So why do they need security? Guards. Well, if I know, just be glad you're getting paid. Hell if I know. Oh, trust me, I am. You really need the money. Huh? Yell. Well, here we are. Wow. Please contain yourself. Oh, before I forget, this path through the woods leads to the apartments. Right, this place is really something, though. Yeah, those bastards spent a buttload of money for this place. Hey, uh, how come they shut it down? Well, if I know someone... <laughs> Hell if I know. Uh, what are they going to do with it? You sure are curious. Sell it, maybe. Until then, we get to sit around and get paid for it. Let's go in. What if I want to go back to the apartments, bud? No, let's go in. Let's go in. This is the main hall. Stay behind me. Come on. Melior. Nice art. Okay. Okay, let's have a quick look. I'll go in the bathroom. No. Nope. Around. Follow me. Come. Come. Security. This is the main elevator. With it, you can access every floor in this sector. You need to have a couple of rounds up there each night. Just to satisfy our boss. Nothing actually happens. Great. Another elevator. It leads to the lower sector. This one is locked tight and only the best employees had access to it. Ne uh, no need to patrol there. The door ahead leads to the warehouse. Yeah, sounds normal. Should I go to the warehouse? No. Uh, sounds interesting, Hoybit. This is your workstation, the security office. Let's go in, shall we, after you. Okay. This is it. There's a couple, uh, cameras set up in this place. But like I said, you need to... Make rounds each night. Now go to your room in the apartment building and get your gear in the closet. Here are the keys to the facility. After that, come straight back. Here, your shift starts immediately. Go on. Leave me alone. Okay, bye, dude. You're kind of a jerk. Have fun working. Can't go in the bathrooms. <laughs> I will walk back to the apartment and get my clothing out of the closet. Yeah, super exciting day. Super exciting day. Uh-oh. I hope no screaming ghosts come at me through the woods. When I'm walking in these scary woods. Oh, no. Oh, no. Do I still have my fence cutters? I don't. Facility. Oh, hey. Hey, some other person. Oh, hi. I didn't realize Buck and I had company. I'm the new security guard, Tom. Nice to meet you. I apologize if I startled you. I'm Eve. So what do you do here? I take care of the place. Keep it from falling apart. Why would they need this place clean? There's nobody here but us. You sure like asking questions, don't you? Yeah, I've been getting that a lot lately. Look, I'm sorry, but I have to leave now. I prepared a room for you. It's on the first floor. Seventh room on the left. Find the uniform and the gear in the closet. I don't want to keep you. Go ahead. Nice meeting. Oh my god. This dialogue. Seventh room on the left. Seventh room on the left. First floor. Do not want to work in a job where the building looks sketchy. Oh, anybody home? No? Anybody home? Seventh room on the left. Just gonna check every door. There's the seventh room on the left. No toilet jokes? No toilet jokes. Oh, I'm a security guard. Ah, I'm not slacking on my first night on the job. Anybody home? Anybody home? Anybody home? These don't. E those aren't even numbers. 
Eight, nine, ten? No. More like square, square, square. Squiggle, squiggle, squiggle. Okay. Here I go. Oh, I got flashlight. Uh, what are you doing? What are you... What are you doing? Spitting them chairs, too. What are you doing? What are you doing? Uh, excuse me? What are you doing? I don't need no stinking flashlight. I ain't scared. What are you doing? Uh oh. Uh oh. It's locked. Buck has the keys. Oh wait, I don't need to go this way. Why lock the doors? It makes no sense. That's true. That's true. Oh. Excuse me. Hashtag, what are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? Oh, I can go in the bathrooms now. Anybody in here? What are you doing? Just checking the bathrooms. Uh oh. Okay. What's this? What's that? It's like highlighted. I can't get it. Oh, I can crouch. What are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? Okay. I don't know what to do in there. Where'd you go, Buck? Buck? Let's go to the warehouse. Put in a service ticket with facilities, you're right. What are you doing? See, what, what do you do with these? Uh... Tapes, key cards, notepad, flashlight. I want that thing. It's a tape. How do I get it? How do I picky uppy? Oh, R1. Oh, cassette tape 5. Can I play that? What? Okay, whatever. That light is uncanny? It sure is. I found a tape in the warehouse. Let me go pick up that other tape. I want that other tape. Big time. Big time want that tape. Give me that. the missing ARG tapes. Oh my god. It's <laughs> Ivy. That's hilarious. Uh, let's go up to the fourth floor. Oh god. Whoa. Okay. Uh, I do not know the combination. A safe key and a password combination. Wow. Well. Uh. Change my safe password to my year of birth. This is uh, getting me finally down. Rumor is the top brass is having legal financial troubles. Just get home safe. On your birthday, what on earth is so important at work you can't tell me about? Happy birthday, dear. I hope you don't have a midlife crisis now that you've turned 40. This was on 
5-14-2013. So he's how old? His birthday was 5-14-2003, 1973. 5-14-73. 5-14-73. No. Seventy three zero five one four. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wait, 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 wait. Someone come to the office and change my safe password to my year of birth. Did I do my math wrong? No. Why doesn't it work? Oh, I need the key also. I don't have the safe key, y'all. Or do I? Oh, nope. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I need the key also. I forgot I also need the key. I don't have the key for that yet. I don't have the key. It just stands there doing the peepee -pee dance. Oh, is this the third floor? Hello? Mm. My shift is over. I need to get some sleep. Oh, you got to sleep in this game? But I feel like I didn't solve any mysteries at all. I feel like I didn't solve one single mystery. Oh, found the tape. like I solved nothing. It's uncanny how strong that feeling is. I got the flashlight. Whoa, I'm just reading everybody's email. Wow, I don't want to read all those emails. We've got tapes around here. This is a big cubicle farm. Beta. Oh my god, I'm not going to walk all the way across all these blocks. Hashtag uncanny. They may give hits. You're right, Hilda, but he said I was tired. I'm going to go back to the uh, apartment and see what up. See what up. Alpha, beta. If each one of those rooms is that big, no way am I going through all those. You got Buck. Bob. Whiteboard the clues so far. You're only here for the graphics, Mikey? Yeah, me too. Oh, I'm falling asleep. Oh. oh, I fell right to sleep. I couldn't make it back to my apartment. I walked too far. What? Okay. So. Now I'm here. Another dream. Oh, I better crawl under these pipes. Ah! Uh-oh. Oh! What happened to you? Oh, that's... Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, my God. Ah! Ah! No! <laughs> oh 
my god. Wow. Meet me in the relaxation room tonight. Second floor, first door on the left. Eve. Second floor, first door on the left. Need my uniform to go outside. My goodness. Crazy Og. And if you don't agree with that, then to hell with you. Day one. Wow. Back to the old grindstone. That was really scary, Hilda. You didn't like that? Alright, I kind of want to see what one more day is like in this game. There are no rights. <laughs> That's a good point. There really aren't. Oh, wait. Eve was on this. Eve is in this place. That means I can snoop around her place while she's up there. Eve? What are you doing? Oh, I got a fire extinguisher. Eve. Nothing back there. How did he wake up back in his bed if he fell asleep at work, though? Happy New Year, Benjamin Adcock. Thanks for joining us. Going well. Playing this, the uh, final of three games, free games for the month, this month on PlayStation Plus. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Second floor, first door on the left. Let's go see what Eve wants. I thought she said... Did I go to the... She lied to me. Oh, first door on the right, and there are no rights. Eve was tricking me. What the hell? Oh, is that Bob? Bob, what are you doing? Oh, took the key. Oh, snap. I found Bob's room. See, those all have numbers. Uncanny sleepwalking ability. Oh, hell yes. That means I could go open that safe though, right? I think I can go open the safe now. Is that a safe key? Oh, that's his car keys. Oh, I stole his car keys. Let's go joyriding in Buck's car. Oops, 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 oops. Car is now unlocked. Whoa, what happened? I'm driving. Oh, God! Okay, what? what? Okay. They followed me back home. I better do as I was told and lay low for a while. Oh my god. He's pulling to the right. I can't stop walking right. What happened? Don't move a muscle. What is going on? Okay. Wow. Okay. 
What? Oh, that's gruesome. That's gruesome also. Not what I expect. What? What the fuck? Eve, what did you do to this? How? Uh. Ah! Okay. She grabbed me and knocked me down. She grabbed me and knocked me down. Oh, what's this? A heavy box. You guys, what is this game? Good morning, darling. Did you sleep okay? Eve, where the hell am I? What are you talking about? You are home. These nightmares of yours must be getting worse. How do you know about my nightmares? What's going on? You're always so tired when you wake up. Put your clothes on and I will make breakfast. I'm getting the rest of your clothes later and keep out of the storage, dear. I just organized everything. What the hell? This game is like a Kafka book. I should get dressed first. I should get dressed first. The more you play, the less it makes sense. Yeah, it seems like it. You think I'm winning, Mikey? I hope so. Pretty bizarre. Pretty bizarre. Oh, the closet's right here. Oh, I'm still a security guard. Hi, honey. I'm dressed. Where's my breakfast? I better not go into storage. Oh. Nope. What are you doing? Mirror is cracked a bit. I could easily break it with something. What about a heavy box? Aha! What are you doing? Okay. Well, I broke the I broke the mirror, honey. I mean, I used a heavy box to break a mirror, honey. Breakfast sounds like it's cooking, maybe, honey. Honey, did you go down into storage? Next time I wake up, I'll be a bug. Almost like butterfly effect. <laughs> it's locked tight. These are some heavy doors. No way of breaking them from here. Oh, oh, storage is open now. Honey. Uh. Oh. Yeah, oh, I'll just push that out of the way. Uh. Uh. I see the vent. I want to interact with the vent. What is this? Oh, a mirror shard. To pry open the vent? No. Oh. Um. Why can't I? Okay. Honey. I don't understand. Yeah, that was a body down there, Richard. I don't understand. Is this... Nope, no, wait, not storage yet. I wanted to go... It's locked tight. These are some heavy doors. No way of breaking them from here. I can't take that or I can take it? Did I open up all the... Oh, there we go. Oh, he did it that time. I dropped the heavy object in the mirror shard. I don't need them anymore. Was I supposed to use the mirror shard for something? Whiteboard. I'm just running along tap and X. I'm 
going to have to read emails again. I'm coming next week. We're having problems because shipment still hasn't arrived. Plus testing on the zip. Oh my god. Bit trashed again. Door is bent open. I really don't think the project will last. Could you bring something down at 5 p.m.? We're discussing a solution instead of a coolant board. Whoa. Uh, this is a car jack or something similar. Wow. Because it installed something. Other P pass. Other Papa Papas. Huh. I don't want to read all those. There's something what? There's something blocking the vent. It can only be open from the other side. Oh, right. Oh, but I'm out here now. I got a tape. Oh, what's this? Help! 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 <laughs> Help! 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 Uh huh. Help! Wait. Help! Help! Okay, I don't want to. Help videotape. How do I select? Do I select those? No? Okay. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh god. Oh god. Ah! Ah! Oh! Oh, he punched me. Don't punch me. Oh no. Oh my god, what is going on in here? Oh, oh, he punched me again. Uh, ah! Ah! Oh! I can't get out. He keeps punching me. What am I supposed to do in here? see me oh no he sees me oh oh he punched me thank you dearies i hope you didn't hurt him too much we love each other you know i will make sure nobody can hurt him ever again tom oh my god my poor tom you can't be trusted always getting into trouble one day you will manage to kill yourself oh my god and what will i do then huh i'm afraid i'll have to keep you from hurting yourself. Don't worry, we can live here forever without any disturbance. I'll take care of you, I promise now. This might hurt a little, but remember, I'm doing this for your own good. Now hold steady, it will be over soon. This dialogue is so brutal to read. Oh my god! Why did you do what? Why? Why? No, come on, no. Oh. Wow. I love you.
What? 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 <laughs> Oh, that's uncanny valley everybody i just beat the game question mark it did say that it takes mil multiple playthroughs so i guess this is one that you want to just uh play over and over again and you learn clues probably each time through wow nimrod good day to you sir yeah no it did mention at the beginning of the game you're supposed to i think you're supposed to go through all the floors of that and just try to go till you survive then you play again but you know more each time you go through it like solving the mystery kind of thing that's weird. What a weird game. But that's Uncanny Valley, everybody. Thanks for tuning in for this first play of Uncanny Valley. It's one of the PlayStation Plus free games of the month, January 2018, this month. And that's the final one of the night. So thanks for tuning into that. And now it's time for the giveaway. Now, if you guys haven't entered the giveaway yet, if you're new to the stream, if you just tuned in, don't forget to type hashtag winning into the chat just one time. If you've already done it, you're fine. Uh, we're giving away a three-month membership to PlayStation Plus. This is for U.S. residents only, and uh, it, it helps if you have a PlayStation. So if you don't have a PlayStation, uh, you don't need to enter. I'll be working on some giveaways for non-PlayStation players uh, soon here on the channel. But I wanted to do, to do this giveaway. We've been doing it. Uh, this is our second month now, and uh, it's been fun so far. It's been fun. I've been enjoying doing these giveaways with you guys. It seems like it works pretty well. And uh, so we played tonight Deus Ex Mankind Divided. We played Batman the Telltale series. And then we played that last one, Uncanny Valley, which was wild. I don't know. What did you guys, which one did you guys like the most? Deus Ex, Batman, or Uncanny Valley? Which ones? I know Batman seemed pretty popular. I've had a few people that wanted to uh, see me play more of that this month. That Uncanny Valley, I just don't even know what to think of that game right now. How weird. It was weird. It was very weird. Let me just do something real fast. Gad Zeus, that was weird. <laughs> Deus Ex, because you have that one, Makiti Tasha. You like that one? Nice. Nice. Batman, 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 Batman. We got a lot of Batmans. Johnny Crash, welcome to it. Yeah, you're tuning in right at the end of it, Johnny Crash. If you want to type hashtag winning, if you're a U.S. resident and you've got a PlayStation, Johnny Crash, if you meet those two criteria, type hashtag winning in the chat to enter the giveaway for the PlayStation Plus three-month membership. Can't wait for Uncanny Valley Game of the Year edition, Ivy Mike. <laughs> Delete, erase, Uncanny Valley. Richard Huntington, you didn't like it? Oh, my goodness. I thought it was pretty funny. I thought it was pretty funny. Oh, man. Oh, man. All right. Well, let's get to it, y'all. Everybody's entered who's going to enter, I think. Welcome to the new viewers rolling in. Don't forget to hit that like button, too. And this uh, it is for subscribers only, so you've got to be subscribed to Gaming Mike's channel for your chance to win the PlayStation Plus three-month membership. But I think it's time to pick it. I think it's just time to pick it. Let's all pretend uncanny never happened. You guys ready? Nightbot's going to announce the winner right now. Ivy Mike. Oh, it's Ivy Mike. Congratulations, Ivy Mike, sponsor of the channel. That's great. Uh, of course, these giveaways brought to you by the sponsors of the channel anyway. So glad that a sponsor won it this month. Even though Ivy Mike was... Oh, my God. Ivy Mike doesn't have PlayStation. Ivy Mike, do you want to re-roll that one? Did you type the hashtag? Let's see, Ivy Mike was talking earlier like he might not want it if because he doesn't have the PlayStation. So we might do a different winner, you guys. It's up to Ivy. It's Ivy's call. Reroll because he did not enter. Yeah, let me look at the Nightbot where it's got your name. It might have auto-entered you because you're a sponsor of the channel, actually. You might have been auto-entered. Let me see. Let me double-check something. I can re-roll a winner, though. Don't worry, you guys. Don't worry. Let me just make sure... Yeah, I think you were auto rolled because you were a sponsor. Okay, we're repicking. We're repicking. Uh, there we go. Stone seven. 
Is Stone 7 even still here? I'm looking through this Nightbot list. Is Stone 7 here? Man, I'm wondering about this Nightbot. I'm wondering about this Nightbot giveaway thing. I gotta take another look at it. Because I'm looking at it and I've, I see Stone 7 in my list, but it says that he's ineligible right now. Bueller. I did say if it was for people that were here though. So if Stone 7's not here, we're going to roll it again. Gosh. This Nightbot thing works a little differently than I thought, I guess. Okay. No, okay, well let's let's Last chance for Stone 7. Stone 7 if you're here, last chance. <laughs> Sorry y'all, technical difficulties. Second second giveaway ever. Second giveaway ever. So, bear with me. This contest is uncanny. Okay, no Stone 7. Then we got Huntington. I rolled it again. It's got Huntington who didn't enter. Oh, you guys. It's got everybody's names who typed winning. It's got everybody's names in the chat, but only the people who typed winning are shown as eligible. So I don't know what to think about this now. It's like... <laughs> yeah, and Richard Hunting... Yeah, I know you don't have a PS4, Richard, so I'm wondering... What's wrong with this thing now? Now I'm wondering what's wrong with this thing. See, and then it just rolled one for JP who did not enter. You guys, the Nightbot's broken! Hold on. Okay, we're going to do it. Plan B. Plan B. Win a three-month PS Plus membership. For one minute, for the next one minute, you're going to type in hashtag winning again. Even if you typed it in before, after Nowhere Man says go, type in hashtag winning again to enter. Okay? Sound good? Let's start it. Let's start it. You got one minute to type hashtag winning in the chat. Only if you have a PlayStation, only if you're a U.S. resident, please. Here we go. Chavo and Sun Gaming. It's on screen. It's working. It's working. Nowhere man's got us covered. Hashtag winning. Type them in, y'all. Type them in. If you have a PlayStation, if you're a U.S. resident, this is going to be a U.S. PlayStation. Even if you're not a U.S. resident, it'll be up to you to figure out how to redeem it because it's going to be U.S. only. Here we go. You can see your names on screen being entered. You're, not a, you're a man, not a typing machine, Mike Young. Is it too much for you? You don't have to type it again. You don't have to. <laughs> I got the Nowhere Man version working at least. Couple seconds left. Last chance. And then he's going to announce the winner. Did he announce the winner? Boy, but I see you in the list. He's in the list. Let's draw winner. There we go. Chavo. There we go, Chavo. Hoy, but I did see you in the list. Those names scrolled past the screen pretty fast, I think, but it's Chavo. There we go. Sorry for the confusion, y'all. That was the uh, that was the best I could do on that one. Chavo does have a PS4, though. That's correct, right? <laughs> Aye. Rough, rough. Sorry. Next time, we'll do it smoother. Last month, I tried to use Nowhere Man to do it. And I messed up, but I knew what I did wrong, but Nightbot came through on it for us on it. And then this month, Nightbot, I don't even know what it was doing. But let's go. Chavo. All right, Chavo. Yes, that's brought to you by the sponsors of Gaming Mice Channel, the crew sponsors. You see them there in the chat with the warp cells next to their names. Thank you very much to them for these sponsorship giveaways. Of course, when we hit 10 sponsors on the channel, I'm going to up the price of the giveaway uh, it's going to be a uh, $50 gift card at that point. 
Um, and that's, yeah, all thanks to your sponsors. So thanks to them. Congratulations to, uh, congratulations to Chavo. Chavo, I'll send you a message with that, uh, with that gift card uh, when I wrap up the stream here. I know I've got you in Discord, so I'll just send it that way. That's usually the easiest, if that sounds good. And thanks to everybody for joining tonight. That was a lot of fun. Sorry for the hiccups, uh, but we got through it, and it looks all good from here. So uh, thanks. Those are the PlayStation Plus free games of the month. You can check them out yourself if you're a Plus member. And join me again next month. We'll be doing another giveaway. Uh, depending on how many sponsors we have, depends on how much we're giving away. So feel free to tune into the live streams in the month between then. I do stream regularly Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays at 11 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. And I think that's good. We'll catch it. Oh, and one last thing. Danny Chadwick is going to be streaming some ci uh, City Skylines tonight. So check out Danny Chadwick's channel. He's going to be coming on in just a little bit here. There's a link in the uh, description. He's in the featured channels on my page as well. So, <laughs> yeah, we should all win something after Uncanny Valley. I feel you, Mike Young. That one was weird. That one was weird. But anyway, I'm going to wrap it up there. Thanks, y'all. Bye-bye.